Okay, we're live. Hey guys, welcome to the stream. Actually, I should turn this bit here off now, since we've achieved the reward, sort of. Welcome to the stream. This is part three of the 24-hour live stream. So, if you're watching the VOD, you got to keep in mind that this is actually the 17th hour. So, uh, this is where I looks like I'm grumpy, but I'm not. I'm just tired. I'm actually very pleased with how this has gone so far. Um, it's exceeded my expectations. So, I think you guys have been extremely generous. But just don't mistake my for, um, <laughs> for unhappiness. It's, it's not the case. <sighs> okay, so. Machinations. Happy New Year? Yeah, Happy New Year, everyone. Happy New Year. Ooh, okay, so what are we up to with this? Alright. Looks like... Excuse me, something's over here. Mario sleeped off. Okay. Uh, we're almost maxed out for food. Uh, I'm... See, if I sally out here, right, if I sally out, yeah, it's gone down to close defeat. It was valiant defeat before. Um, the problem here is, even if I won that battle, they're just going to besiege us. So, while I don't want to lose a major settlement, we're pretty much maxed out for food to meet anyone. Yeah, food anyway. This has been awesome, thank you man. No, it's, it's been my pleasure. I, I do enjoy playing Skaven. You know, they are my favorite race to play. Uh, and you know, doing it, doing a 24 hour live stream. I think this is this was a good way to end the year. Good way to end a crappy year. I think, I think that's, yeah, I think it's a good way to end it. End it on a positive note, because it has been a really crappy year. Um. Alright, what are we doing now? I need to try to lure Marius over here. So, I think we're just going to need to stand in ambush stance. Like, here. And here. And just see if he comes over here. Because we need time for Zvorak to get developed. Marble doesn't provide anything of value? No. Who his bosses? <laughs> it doesn't provide much or whatever. And this one here can have Yep, that. Do you know why it's taking so long for them to release anything if substance for the game? The game's been stale for a long while now. Look, I don't know. I can only speculate that they have had a staff issue. That a lot of people left the company or were shifted around. Or that working with Warhammer 3 is such spaghetti code that the people who are working on it literally don't know how to fucking navigate the code. And they're, they're just trying to fix it. Um, it does seem as though the main developers for... Total Warhammer are complete and utter trash, and that the DLC team has to come in and basically clean up. But I don't know. I, I just I don't know what it is. Creative Assembly are not transparent. They don't tell you what the reasons are for anything. So you, we can speculate all day long, but they're definitely not doing what they said they were going to do. There's, there's something went wrong. I just don't know what. They they said that DLCs are probably more frequent, but it's actually less frequent. So, I just I just don't know. All right, Martech is not really safe, but just try to get that done. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, let's get that up in there. Will the development of Hyena affect Warhammer 3 update times and quality-wise? It shouldn't. It really shouldn't. 
They should have separate teams. Creative Assembly is a very big company. Um, it shouldn't, but it's always possible that they shifted a lot of their workforce over to Hyenas. I don't think that makes a lot of sense. I think it's far more likely that a lot of their workforce actually quit. Because... Creative Assembly is known for not paying very well. Um, as far as, like... As, as, like, as far as the game industry goes, um, salaries at Creative Assembly tend to be lower than average. And we're also fairly sure that it's not a great place to work either, especially if you're a woman. But, again, just allegations at this point. So, we can speculate, but we don't know for sure. And we probably will never know for sure. And it really comes down to just believe whatever you want. Because, yeah, just, just don't know. Alright, uh, well, let's have a look at heroes. Because I still got a fair bit of money. Uh, still haven't found a good chieftain yet. Don't forget that Me Too fiasco. Well, that's what I was referring to. Oh, man. I'm just not getting cunning. Me. Well, it's not there. Alright, I gotta find something to spend this money on. Yeah, Brion's not super safe. Just leave that be for now. I find that upgrading this to tier 5 is not a particularly high value. At least it doesn't cost that much to build it. Alright, do that and that. Yeah. I don't think there's anything more I can do there. Okay, let's move on. What did you think of Victoria 3? Are you going to play Manalord when it comes out? I... didn't get Victoria 3. Um... I haven't actually met Slanesh yet. Uh, yeah, I didn't get Victoria 3. I haven't played it. From what I've heard, like, I follow Lord Lambert on Twitter and on YouTube. And typically speaking, I check out what he thinks of a Paradox game before I'll make any purchase. And he's been, very funnily enough, basically mirroring... Sorry, mirroring. I can't even think of the right word. Um, it's, he's been saying similar stuff about Victoria 3 that what I've been saying about Warhammer 3. And I'm just not interested in, in dealing with Paradox's bullshit. I'm just not interested. I was never into Victoria 2, never played it. So I just gave it a miss. Mirroring? Mirroring. I'm not sure. Alright, we should be able to catch him. Mirroring. Yeah, yeah, that's what I was trying to say. <laughs> yeah, if you haven't... Oh, nice. If you haven't checked out Lord Lambert, you should check him out. He's a good dude. If you're interested in paradox stuff. 
Uh, the Colonel 32 did a two-lot super chat. Uh, well, uh, super sticker. Appreciate that, dude. Yeah, just order that. Fuck, this guy gets hit in order as well. But he's alive. And I think I'll go with the replenishment because I need to keep moving. Well, that sorted out that beastman army, so that's good. Oh man, Torgavan's actually being quite aggressive. Do you know what's funny? It's been a good thing that I've had that Storm Vermin army because it's quite strong in auto resolve. <laughs> EU4 is the deepest, to be honest. Yeah, I'd say e EU4 is the deepest of the Paradox games, but my favorite is Crusader Kings 2. Can you explain to me, a foul foul, why ick it in the Doom Flayer mount, not on the wheel? Simple answer to that, it's smaller. Oh, nice! I thought I'd have to fight that manually. Cool. We've got a good replenishment rate, so I don't expect them to... Oh, are you kidding? Are you kidding? Are you kidding? <laughs> they took out my rebels for me. Well, I don't know what happened with that. Cool, Jagged Horn Tribe. Dealt with with Met Karaza Karak. Uh, that's fine. What brings you to the halls of my ancestors? Yeah, if I offer to go to war with Clan Rictus, at least I'll meet Clan Rictus that way. I like money. Sure. Bone Rattlers, on the other hand, I don't know if I want to meet them. Let me just check. You got money for me? I mean, Bone Rattlers all the way up here. Fine. That's how it rolls. <laughs> how do you still have energy? I don't. I'm running on fumes now. Running on on uh, depleted warpstone. I'm buggered. All right. Looking at Al Haik, the garrison is fairly beat up. And there is fairly large forces. Most of it is peasants. I'm maxed out on food, though. So I need to occupy something now. That fucking Marius Liedorf. What a bitch. Where the fuck did he go? This way, way. The iron hammer weighs heavy in mind. I think he confederated Karakirin. All right. As much as I want to go and uh, like save Al Hayek, I think what we need to do is actually go take Vulture Mountain because I gotta spend some some food. Kill targets now. We'll have to fight this manually because auto resolve is not good for these sort of sieges. Oh, uh, it says it's fine, but I should fight it manually. Yeah, I should. Because, yeah, Ark and the Black could be right around the corner. Okay, Winky Wanky Woo. You got timed out for saying shit like that. So, you're an idiot. Now, here's the thing as well. As a reward for hitting our goal with the Fawcett Society... I have to take the Sword of Cain. So I've got eight hours to do that. So we really need to pick up the pace and either order resolve a lot more, because I need to I either need to go to Ulth one or have the Sword of Cain come to me. We didn't specify anyone's particular has to pick it up. I just have to pick it up by the end of this episode. So that means if I hit eight hours and I haven't picked it up, but I still could pick it up, I have to keep going. <laughs> so I'm going to try my best to pick it up. All right, we're going to bombard the crap out of anything that can shoot at us. Okay, these ones here don't shoot. 
Oh, I thought I had the health potion on you. That's not. So get rid of this real quick. Oh crap. To echo someone else, have you played Frostpunk and what's your thoughts? If so, I haven't played Frostpunk, but it definitely seems like the kind of game I'd be into. It just comes down to time. I've heard a lot of good things about it, but I just never got into it myself. Take Ica Claw and this one, and we push for the um, the victory points. Your fortress incredibly difficult, skill matters, massively deep game. Uh, I would totally be into something like that. Just, again, time. I haven't played it. Yeah, that that is a game that I would very much enjoy. I want to cap this. So I want to get rid of the... Um, yep. Okay, all good there. What about Satisfactory? Yes, I do play Satisfactory. Love it. Fantastic game. It's definitely better than what it was in Warhammer 2. And it does last a long time when overcasted. I don't think it's anything spectacular. Do you enjoy any FPS games? Not really, no. Remember you say you avoid Minecraft because you know it'd suck you in completely? Yeah. Yeah, that's correct. The Total War series does a shit job about teaching you the game. I only learn through you. Yeah, that's... Yeah, that's the... Yeah. Yeah, they they don't teach you... The game... The in-game stuff doesn't teach you very well. Yeah. You have to really learn on your own. Because it can be a bit deceptive. Rip Dark Tide content. I was never going to cover it.
This guy really into Dyson Sphere program. Yeah, I was looking into that. I might get that one day. Alright, we definitely want to go to tier 5 there. Cool, because yeah, I was maxed out on food. Trying to spend the food as quick as I can, but wait, bloody whack a mole. Chief Warlock, it I will not. My technocracy. I think I'll hold on to this. Oh, but we'll see. Okay, okay, okay. So that's good. He plays Overwatch, I'll for you. I do not play Overwatch. All hail, Honed Rat. Master Engineer. So if they've got 14 units. Alright, let's have a look. Right. It's a bit of a risk. But if I jump over there, yeah, it's a bit of a risk. But if I jump over there, we could take Karak Azor, Tark Azor, whatever it's pronounced as. Um, that would be very good for us, for sure. All right, we got some, we got some attacking to do here. Alright, this guy here. Yep, renowned and feared. Cool. Alright, we need to take them both out. So, how about you attach here? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Machines and that sorcery! Silent killer. Good, 100% ambush success chance. Take him out. Here we go. Okay, damage doesn't seem too bad, and... Overrun them. Bit of damage, bit of damage. We'll cover a little bit. We should be in good enough shape to also take out Dursu. Actually, it might be better if this one here actually stays out of it. Uh, let's just see, firstly. Yeah, look, I, I just need to replace them, but taking out Durthu... I should be free to recruit for a few turns now. Auto's gonna kill those storms. Yeah, we, we did lose a few of them, but I just have to replace it. That's the, that's the rules. Alright, get back over here and get recruiting. So, if that gets done, that'll be the largest we've had it so far, and they've got a bit more experience than the previous ones did, so that's exactly. thanks to um, Renowned and Feared. So that's good, and this army here is getting better. Envoy of the Council would be good. Now, there is a reasonably large military presence out this way. It's t size 10. So we need to be ready to deal with that. Could you just get, get ahead over this way for us? Okay. Good plan schemes. Obvious. Okay. Good.
right, this guy could probably use some equipment, um, because he's immortal. Actually, give him warpstone armor, that'd be good. And what else we got? The fell blade? Do it. And what else we got? Brass cleaver? No, I don't need that. Okay, talisman of that. And enchanted item, you can have one of those. Okay, cool. Okay. Last thing to do militarily is figure out what to do with these guys. If I jump over there with Vectic and get intercepted, there's a good chance I can win against it because Vectic is really powerful. Vectic, children. Skitterleap. I will not obey. This is... If I get intercepted with this one, however... Barrow. Barrow. Oh. Oh, 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 dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear. Oh, no. Oh, dear. I, I think I've, I've, I've been too aggressive there. That is, that is heavy duty. That is really heavy duty. Um, good, good, good. Got intercepted. Underway intercepted. It's always a risk. It's always a risk. Um, but by doing this, we're not going to be able to win this battle. There's no way. There's no way. Uh, especially because it's an underway fight. Uh, I will have to replace this army. But... If I could at least do some damage to this army, I might be able to save Vectique. It was always a risk. Bye bye, Ava. <laughs> I just have to replace her. So yeah, I really shouldn't have jumped down there, uh, up that way. But I had no idea what was there. Um, but I took a risk, and it did not pay off. There is no way I can win this. There's no way. Nuke him? Yeah. Yeah. I'll do that. If nothing, kill his mortars. That's what it's all about. Just do just do damage. Just do as much damage as I can. I'll try to put Ava in a corner there. They're technically attacking me. Problem is, these guys have really low leadership. <laughs> Uh, I'll just do what I can. Okay, so this one, if you could just stay right over there. Or just do the best you can. Have you got Howling Warp Gale? Okay, that could be useful. Alright, I just want one over here. I just want... I want to know what's going on. Mortars are shooting at us. I guess that's good. Border men have a speed of 84. Okay. I am definitely going to use a nuke here. There is no way we can win this if, unless we use a nuke. And even then, I don't... I don't know. Bring some more over here, because I want to try to catch this one. Them doing this is really stupid. No, don't advance. Don't advance. Stay still. Stay still. Maybe I should have ordered more menace belows. Try to move out of the way. No, they're gonna move out of the way! Ah, too slow. Yeah, that fucking wrecked them. They lost a lot of units there. Okay, we got a few units over here. that leadership. On very hard battle difficulty, that's gonna hurt. 
Come on, border men, come at me. Come at me, bro. I need more over here. That nuke might have just saved Vectik's life. Yeah, avoid Carl Franz. That's not worth fighting. We've got Metis below that needs to go for the mortars. Okay. There we go. Try to get around him if we can. We need to go for this one. Okay. Go for that. Okay, good. They're ripping the border men to shreds. But we've got Reich's guard coming in. Good thing we've got armor piercing. Come on, come on, come on. We gotta get out of there. Out of there. Is that anti large? Yeah. Okay, that doesn't matter. We're actually small. Oh, damn it. Oh no, it's. it's Alright, Carl Franz being over here, if he lands and we just like dogpile him, literally, we might actually be able to beat him. As long as we're all fighting together. Because yeah, that kind of combat, all on one, makes a big difference. Does he have any regen? No. Problem is though, he has a leadership debuff. And let's just see how the doggos go there. Oh, this one is getting wrecked. Well, he's he is taking damage, but he's also absolutely wrecking us as well. We need to keep trying to get the charge bonus in on him. We'll just keep cycle charging. If we could just get him off the battlefield, make a big difference. He hasn't done that much damage in the grand scheme of things, considering who he is. Come on, move, 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 move. Get at him. Get at those Reich's guard. Okay. All of them charge at the Reich's guard. We should actually be able to overwhelm them. I don't think they got their charge bonus in there. I think it's actually working out reasonably well. So far. Like, I don't know if we're going to win, but we're doing a ton of damage to them. They're just being really stupid, which is yeah, typical of Wormer 3 AI. Problem's gonna be though that as these units take more and more damage, they're just gonna keep routing earlier. Oh, this Reich's got are unbreakable. And of course, as my guys keep breaking, they only they can only break three times. Should get in there, help out. Warlock master! Yeah, this Reich's guard is gonna get wiped. Good. Gonna get some hits in on him. Warlock oh, I could have used this on the Reich's guard, but we got it. I think Carl Franz unbreakable. Yeah, he is. Warlock, move. 
All right, we got we got more incoming over here. Some more Reich's guard. That's okay. Look, if they just keep bringing their units over here one at a time, we'll we'll get them. I think. A unit can be terrified many times in a battle, but it can only actually break three times. Ooh, that one nearly went off the battlefield. Come on. Gotta keep cycle charging. Need those charge bonuses. Alright, we got incoming here as well. That's not good. That's not good. We got we got incoming here. Gotta get those, rid of those guns. left the battlefield there. Yeah, I still don't think I'm going to win. But damn, we are doing some damage. Damn it if we aren't doing some damage. Come on, let's try to get rid of Carl Franz. Come on, guys, try to get rid of Carl Franz. Get him out of here for a couple of turns. We're gonna get army lost any second now. Fight, fight. Any second now. Come on guys, Come on, try to take out Carl Franz. If you do, we'll save Victique for sure. Victique doesn't have any rattling guns. Come on guys. Come on guys. There's no way. We just don't have enough. Need magic. They're too cowardly. <laughs> if they had more experience, it'd be a different story. Oh, poor Ava. We'll raise, we'll raise another Ava. Yeah, there we go. Well, we did a lot of damage to them, um, and we took out some important units. Valiant defeat, so that's better than what the order reserve said. We didn't stand a chance. Like, look at that. Like, our army's not even that badly damaged. They took a lot of damage. But yeah, they're just fucking cowards. Wasn't one yet doing great. Nah, we didn't stand a chance. The problem was... Once they're once they've taken some degree of damage, they they just can't hold. Their leadership is too low. But yeah, we did do a lot of damage to them. I don't think that he'll try to attack us. Um, uh, against um, the new mobile. Another faster doggo armor. Yeah, I need to recruit another one. Unfortunately, I lost that um, forbidden rod. There's 16 units in there. They actually still might make it. I shouldn't have jumped so close to this. That was such a dumb idea. 
Alright, well, we gotta replace the doggo army. It won't take long. So that was on a warlock master. Uh, disciplined would be good. Yeah, for extra leadership. Master Engineer! There we go. Won't take us too long to get that back up. I'm a little bit concerned about this. Yeah, because if he attacks it, right, I won't be able to withdraw. I'll have to stand and fight. And let's be real, he'll, he'll make that attack. Let the bell scream, scream. Do not take me for a fool. Ready to kill, kill. Oh, Regiment of Renown. Yeah, do you know what you need? You need rattling guns. Yeah, okay, now we stand a chance. Yeah, do I have anything else? Maybe the Council Guard would be good. And we'll see what we do. Red line for doggos. Uh, yeah, I kind of want to get the blue line done first. But if we have a look at what we get out of the red line, is that Molder knowledge? That gives us speed and charge bonus. That's that's okay. But what they really need is leadership. All right. Well, you know, we gave it a shot. That was very silly to make that jump. Very very silly. But we'll see how we go. All right. So Ikit Claw. Needs more red line skill. Reinforcements might come from behind. And that's fine. I'll be able to take them out before uh, the other army shows up. I hope. Just have to wait and see. Try to be a better assassin in the future. Alright, so we've got a little bit of money to spend. Let's spend it. Okay, Eye of the Panther seems relatively safe at the moment. Al Haik does not seem safe. Alright, technologies. So we just finished promoted on merit. That's good. That's definitely really good. What else do we need? Fight dirty. Let's go that way. Okay. Alright, any new enemies to declare war on? We've got a bit of, um, yeah, no new enemies. We've got a bit of, uh, warp fuel. We should use it. Make another doom rocket? Yep. Yes! We got two out of it. Nice. That's what you want to see. Alright. I think we got a hell of an intern coming up here. But, I, I think I could win with this. Because, you know, Vectik is very good. And this one here is on a brood horror. We'll just see how we go. Okay. What happened there? I find your presence in. All right, moving on. 
You can put Pack Master in Ava Army to make them stronger. That is true, yeah. No, 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 no. Sorry, it's supposed to be a full stack um, of just doggos. It's not supposed to be a strong army. Repair some damaged buildings. They'll repair on their own over time. Are you first defeat? No. No, not in this campaign. First army defeat, but garrisons have been smashed. Equip items on the hero. I don't think it'll make enough of a difference, and I don't want to risk losing my items. Alright, here we go. He is actually going for it. Alright, and now it just depends on whether or not... It says I can withdraw, but I really don't think I can. I'm gonna need... Menace Blows. Says Valiant Defeat. Alright, the, um, the reinforcements will take some time to come in. They are reasonably good. We should not... If we retreat, I'm pretty sure it won't let us, because we have nowhere to actually go. Um, it just depends on where they're coming from. If we have a look at this map here, Here we go. Now we find out if what I did was truly catastrophic. Because the thing is as well, after this battle, it's likely that Balthazar Guild will try it as well. So we not only need to win this battle, but we need to do it well. Um, if all of their reinforcements show up from over here, well then, good. Enormous Cacious deck. Uh, that would be good, but not essential right now. Alright, the enemy reinforcements are coming from behind us, so if we can just delay them for two minutes, I'll take out Clan Angren's forces first. Typically speaking, they do wait for enemy reinforcements to arrive. We had a disaster battle like this the other day. So we get ready to put down the menace belows in two minutes when they show up. Same thing with that one as well. Um, we need to bomb the living shit out of uh, this army when it comes in. Don't get in the way. Yours. You guys just just hang tight for now. Okay, so Carl Friends and his his forces should wait there. Because they usually want to wait for their reinforcements. Usually, not always. How about you go and scout just in case? I don't really need you in this situation just now, and I can bring you back in really quickly. Uh, Javier Pagan did a three dollar super sticker. Thanks, dude. Appreciate the super, uh, super sticker support. Let's go do. I just gotta know if they're coming over here. If they're not, we're good. If they are. Shit. Yeah, they're coming. Alright, I need to create a little bit of a distraction. If I do this, they might run all the way back there. This buys me a tiny skerrick of time. Yeah, it worked. It worked. It bought me just a tiny bit of time. Um, would a nuke there be good? I can barely see what's going on. No, don't worry about that right now. 46 seconds. I believe that actually worked. It bought us. It bought us precious seconds. Alright, 
that. Here they come. Buy me precious seconds. Right, here we go. Vectic, get in there. Plague him up. You bomb over here. Shit, he's here. Luckily, he's almost dead. Buy me some time. Vectig, hold him back. Come on, shoot him. Oh, this guy is taking a beating. Get him out. Guy out of there. Come on, shoot. Ooh, Vectic, no, where's my healer? Oh no, my rattling guns. Damn it, car friends, I needed to buy just a little bit more time. You get in here, I need you to bite car friends like once. He's got 59 fucking health. Get out of here. Get out of here. Buy more time. Get Vectic out of there. Buy more fucking time over here, please. Oh no, he's gonna wipe out Vectic. Come on. Come on, you get in there. Come on, take him out. Okay, Carl France is gone. Good. Man, what a shit fight. I think we're okay, somewhat. Yeah, they're trying to shoot at Vectic. They've heard of the legend of Vectic. Still got a nuke if I absolutely need to, and I think I do. Hopefully that doesn't kill too many of my own units. <laughs> it definitely did. Deathwing did a U Y U one fifty super chat. All right, thanks, dude. Appreciate the support. Alright, army lost them. I won. <laughs> if you can call that a win. Oh my god! <laughs> Play 
All right. All right, well, Vecti can't regenerate. Um, this guy here can, so just give him some time to regenerate. And then guilt attacks. Yeah, but his army on its own isn't going to be that big of a deal. His army was nowhere near as strong as um as Karl Franz's. Nowhere near as strong. All right, that'll do. <laughs> that was tough. Yeah, I needed a little bit more time. Like, Carl Franz landing down on us like that, that really hurt. I just needed a little bit more time. Because what I wanted to do was finish off with the dwarves and then just shoot Carl Franz. But, you know. That's not how it went. Alright, at least all of the, um, the avalanche mortars are completely fine. Rip Council Guard. That's okay, they did what they were supposed to do. Alright, we definitely need to take replenishment. No two ways about that. Hey, we gained good food. And the legend of Vectite continues. Still unstoppable. Alright, now we find out if Gelt wants to try his luck. He might not even be able to get to us. Let's see. <laughs> My turn! Gelt's army is nowhere near as dangerous. Close defeat. Yeah, Gelt's army is nowhere near as dangerous. Oh, wow, we actually routed a lot of those units. Um, and it's quite possible Gelt will wait a little bit longer before coming at us because his army is slower than Karl Franz's. And he's on he's on horseback. This one here is flying, though. I have to stand and fight. I don't have a choice. We'll definitely need another nuke. <laughs> That's what they're for. That's what they're for. Alright. I'd actually really like it if the dwarf army came from here. This time. What's it going to be? Heal Searing Doom you a shit ton? I don't think that's going to hurt us as much as you might think. Yeah, it's still coming from bar. Man, of all the bad strategic moves, that was so bad jumping over here. If I manage to get through this, though, I'll get Karakazor. I should have put the Skalm on him. Thought he had it. Alright, well, uh... Shit. Alright, now this time, you be ready to deal with um, that one, because he won wasn't really that useful against them. When the flying heroes start coming down this way, you need to deal with it. You guys, hold that ground. These guys here need to bombard. Vectique, you need to... You're going to need to do that stuff again. Um, you as well. You guys as well. Maybe hang back a little bit over here, Vectique, and I'll summon the unit and run in. Territory. 
Right, I want you to come over here and we need to be popping minutes below us down on. Well, let's, just, let's just see how we go. Oh, God. Yeah, they're coming. It's coming. I gotta find their mortars. He's coming in. You, you get out of this way a little bit, maybe. This guy's coming in hot. Okay. How much time do we have? A minute. Okay. Bring him in. Let's let's just try to kill him early. Sky anti large? No. Beasts cower tremble. Your your desire. Faster, scurry. All will obey. War beast trainer. Tyson, hurry. He can speak to me. Good hunting ground. Ready, ready. That's working. Here we go. You guys should actually turn around because he's a freaking armored as hell. Mickey K did a $31 super sticker. Thanks for being you. Alright, thanks dude. Appreciate that. Uh, timing was awful, but <laughs> appreciate it nonetheless. Let's go. These guys over here. Come on, go, 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 go. We got incoming here. We got incoming. This would be a good time to use a nuke. Just gotta pin them down first. We've almost defeated the dwarfs here. Bye bye, guilt and friends. Are oh, they gonna try to dodge it? Are they? Come on. Divert. Oh! That's a good nuke. It's a real good nuke. What orders? Strike, strike! This way, there! Me best best, see? Alpha rats! It won't stay like a dinosaur one! Fight, fight! You hate the Anaka! Rattling gun! We, we obey! Mortars are on us over here. We need to get rid of them. Master. This guy back. I'm feeling like we're pretty good here. Stab, stab. Good, dwarfs are defeated. Oh, 
I won. The legend of Vectique continues yet again. That was a lot easier, that one. I don't think any units got wiped out. <laughs> oh my god. If I didn't hire those Regiment of Renown, we would have been so dead. Lives. Yeah, he was always going to get away. All right. Heroic victory that time. Yeah, well, it didn't take anyone near as much damage. That hero there died outright. That's good. God, I've still got to go get the Sword of Cain. <laughs> Shit. Oh, man. I really wish you guys didn't choose that. What I'll do, though, one hour before we finish, if I haven't done it yet, I'll just put divert all of my energy into just invading Ulth 1. Just throw everything I got at it. And the settlement garrison has been wrecked, but it will probably fully replenish. So that's great. Yeah, it'll probably fully replenish because it hasn't had their turn yet. I just hope somebody sends the sword of Cain to me. Oh, good. The army that was sitting in there just got wrecked. Good. Yeah, I got you, Grom. Not going to be able to use this army because it's recruiting for another turn, but I, this one here should be sufficient. Excuse me. What will you do if the Sword of Cain isn't in Ulthwine at this time? Because the commander is somewhere else? Like, I'll just do whatever I can. I'll just do what I can. Like, it, it, I'm sure you guys aren't going to hold me to some unreasonable task. I'll just do what I can. Sometimes the Sword of Cain is just so far out of reach, you just can't get to it. Alright, the Sword of Cain is apparently here right now. It's not too far away from our current position. Alright, Ambush was foiled, but his army's in bad shape. There's actually some good units there, but we should still be able to beat the... Oh, he's level 23. Alright. 
Chief Warlock, it is clear. Pretty good. Oh yeah, they didn't launch the attack at Al Haik, giving me time to recover. Good. Okay, I was thinking that it would like fully replenish, but it only like half replenished. <laughs> you know, something. Let the bear scream, um, scream. I should actually be able to beat that with these two. Warlock, master of Scryer. Slow things, make them slower. Oh, we actually succeeded. Nice. I will not not much damage though. Uh, yep. You need to just keep recruiting. If they decide to attack us, I'll just do the best I can. No malice detected. The, the council's voice. Oh God. Futile. Yeah, this will end up happening sometimes. They've, they've broken through. And these settlements are not going to be able to defend for very long. I think not. Losing Vardanos would suck. Um, but I don't have any armies here. Losing losing these two settlements here, but gaining Karak Izor would be good. Would be worth it. Alright, I need to take this out. Another thing I could do is jump in the underway down here. I might get intercepted. Um. Diabolic, Long have I fought. What level is the settlement? Yeah, taking this away from him would be a, probably a good idea. Yeah. Sucks about this. There's no way I'd be able to win against a Wood Elf army with garbage like this. No way. All I can hope is that they'll sack it and just like buy me some time to get back there. Alright. Um, I can get to Sorcerer's Island. We're pretty good for food. Yeah, it looks like Vulture Mountain is relatively safe. Don't worry about Lash Yek, that's fine. Is this live? No, this is dead. Pre-recorded. Alright, and... Just occupy it tier 1, because... That's fine, just, just gotta defeat Arkham. Because we're about to spend 120 anyway, over here. Alright, now, he needs to have a potion. A Skalm. Where is it? Uh, enchanted item. There it is. Ring bell. Uh, Nifis World became a member for three months. Last chance to click like this, I guess. Sure. Maybe. We'll see. Thanks for the membership. Appreciate it, dude. Uh, okay. I need you to be more missile resistant. I can still get Regiment from of Renown from here for some reason. Not likely.
Yeah, we should fight this manually. Legend must have dreams about total war. No. All my all my dreams are gone. <laughs> It's nice seeing you do a campaign again. My favorite kind of content. Understand why you don't do it anymore, though. Yeah, fair enough. All right, let's have a look at how we're going with the uh, charities. We're at 12,758 with um, Extra Life. Cool. We're at 5173 with Dash Hounds and Fawcett Society. We're up to... 2,000! Wow, we're not by a fair bit there. Appreciate all those um, donations there, guys. Apparently, Legend donated $50. That wasn't me. Somebody else donated it. But I and Matthew donated 100 there. Very generous of you guys. Appreciate it. How much hours has it been? Uh, we're 17 hours into it. So we've got seven more to go. Avalanche mortars will thin them out, and then we just rush on in. Also, I could use the plague or two to uh, thin them out as well. Imagine um, avalanche mortars with unlimited ammo, like um, endless barrel. How insane would that be? All right, well, let's get these two to run around over here. So they're gonna have to run to try to catch up. Uh, these ones can move forward a little bit. But uh, yeah, we've thinned them out a fair bit. Okay, yeah, this one did heaps of damage. Alright, move back. Okay, we in? Yep, yeah, we're in. Can you cheese it? Can you cheese it by allied gunnery white reloads? Uh, yeah, I guess you could theoretically do that, yeah. Nothing stopping that from, from working. Not exactly unlimited, but yeah, you'd get a decent amount of ammo out of that. Stop over here. Keep 
them pinned down if you wouldn't mind. This looks like it's going pretty damn well. Like, they're not even really trying to do anything about it. They're too thinned out anyway. Imagine stealing Tom from Karaza Karak and have his sole job being to refill avalanche mortars with 8 or 9 real stocks. Mm. Or, imagine somehow being able to recruit the avalanche mortars into um, Eltharian's army. I, I don't think it's possible to do that. But imagine if you could. Well, they just don't seem to care that we've captured these points, so... Let the battle win. You're gonna buy a Dachshund and name him Legend? Okay. Casper Kuzak became a new member. Thanks, dude. Appreciate the support. Yeah, they just, um, I don't know, man, they just don't want to do anything about it. Which race is your personal favorite to play? Just getting into the game and I want to try something fun. Uh, my personal favorite is Skaven. Um, another one that I really enjoy in Warhammer 3 is Tomb Kings and... Uh, Scarbrand. Uh, we should be okay to sack and occupy it. I'll have enough movement. Okay, maybe we get lots of money. Oh, boy. That was a rough ride. We really put Vectig through the ringer in that one. Oh, God, is that all I've got for you? <laughs> is there anything I can globally recruit in one turn? Nothing good. Alright, so this one here. Oh, God. Yeah, probably just best let that repair itself over time. I get that it reduces upkeep costs, but probably not going to... It's like 5%. It's not going to be that much. Um, but yeah, reduce upkeep costs for warp fire throws, rattling guns, warp lock jazz elves, poison wing globideers, death globe bombardiers. 
Because I also don't have that many of those units, but yeah. An extra 2% isn't worth spending 3 grand. It'll repair pretty quickly. Excuse me. Yeah, it's not worth it. To, re to repair it, that is. Alright, we've got to get this defended. I guess what I could do is just raise whatever regiments of Renown I've got left, because I did make a lot of money from that. So, let's get a Grace here of Plague. Hire whatever regiments of Renown we possibly can. And any and all that's available. Uh, that actually is a lot. Uh, that actually might protect the city. Probably not going to protect Zaraxil. No, not for that. Um, but only one of them will be able to get it then, and that's fine. Yeah. Don't think so. Whew. All right. Master engineer. No for you. So they're pretty weak. Any new enemies? No. No, 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 no. Okay. 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 What happened to the Argolon force here? Must still be in the area. Um, as much as I'd love to get to Massive Oracle, I think best thing to do, stay in ambush dance, protect okay. this army here. Wish there was a way we could show you our appreciation for what we do for us, man. Wish you a great 2023 and beyond. Oh, thanks, dude. Uh, y you guys do enough. It's all right. I, I get, I get that you appreciate it. Chief Warlock, it <laughs> like you guys have been super generous with your donating. Um, you don't feel like you owe me anything. Because you don't. Just send me... Dick pics. No, I'm just kidding. Don't do that. Never chatted before, but thank you for all you do. Ignore the haters and take care of yourself, man. You do great work. Alright, thanks, dude. Just addressing that hater comment. I don't feel like I have haters. And if I do have haters, there's so few in numbers. I just want to point out that the only reason I address haters is because I don't find it funny. That That's it. Uh, I don't lay up awake at night going, Oh my god, 0.1% of the Total War community doesn't like me because I cheese. It doesn't bother me. But yeah, I, I the thing is, you just got to understand my personality. I don't shy away from conflict. I run straight into it. It's just who I am. So when somebody comes up to me and is like, Oh, I don't like you. Yeah, I kind of, I kind of fight back. That's all. But it doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother me at all. Good. Begin the summoning. Sneaky infiltrator. All right. Looks like all of our movements for this turn have been made. Uh, still got a fair bit of money left over, which is pretty good, I guess. Uh, I, I don't think we're gonna hold on to Brion. Castle Carcassonne is basically always going to come under attack, so I think we should just keep building up the defenses there. Al Haik actually is managing to defend itself, so let's get that walled up. Because, yeah, I think they're only recruiting peasants at the moment. Kofa, let's go with this and upgrade it. Okay. Alright, technologies. We just finished researching Fight Dirty. Extra speed for infantry unit is very good. 
But I really want extra ambush success chance. And virulent plans. Also, we should have a look to see what heroes are available. Nothing. Nothing. And... Oh my god. That is not getting traits. Wow. Somebody call Owen Wilson, because, wow. <laughs> You're in One day, me. Okay. No malice detected. And, yeah, Ass Blaster, okay. going to be a revolt here. If I don't tax it, I buy an additional turn. Okay, how much money am I losing? That's fine. Yeah, one turn here. Because there's probably dwarfs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Buy, buy that time. I'll have Vicar Claw come back over here and take it out. Next turn. Because, yeah, what they could do is launch the attack straight away, and we've barely got any garrison here. It just no, it wouldn't be good. Alright, we'll see how we go with this turn here. I think we've got a rough one. But taking Karakizor away from... Or Izor, or whatever. Taking that away from Clan Angrand is really good. Really, really good. I need to get into Athalor and get rid of these fucking wood elves. Alright, let's move on. Yep. I just want to say thank you for getting me into this franchise. I hope this year has treated you well. <laughs> hope this year treat you well as well. Uh, do you think CA would rework how Dark Elves slave mechanics work, or Dark Elves in general? If so, what do you think they should do? Um, I no, don't know if they're going to, but I think that they should. I think that it's currently in a really terrible state. Um, look, there, there's a lot of things you could do with the Dark Elves slave mechanics to make it better. Um, Pretty much every suggestion I've heard from the community seems like a good idea. Um, I really don't think anyone cares about what my ideas are for it. All I can say is that I don't personally like what they've done with the slave mechanic. I don't enjoy playing Dark Elves because of it. It, I, I really don't think it's very well thought out. It's not an it's a, it's just not an engaging, intelligent system. It's just very gamey and nonsensical. Just it doesn't make sense. I knew it. I knew there was one of those armies there. That's okay. At least I know where it is now. Damn, Valiant Defeat, giving me some degree of hope. Dwarfs would have already had their turn as well. I mean, I can give it a shot. Worst case scenario is I lose. Oh, 
Okay. What I dislike about the slave change was the time spent on it rather than other things, which are actually a problem. I hate changing stuff for no reason when there is broken stuff on the game. Yeah, I understand that argument, and I kind of agree, but a lot of people really... But the Dark Elves were not a popular race in Warhammer 2. And they're also equally not a popular race in Warhammer 3, right? Um, the slave system is something that Creative Assembly just isn't really getting right. Now, the reason why a lot of people don't mind the old system is because it's heavily abusable. Which can be fun, right? And that the AI didn't use it. The problem with the new system is that it's not abusable in any way. And it's also not fun in any way. It's very punishing. And it's just a, just a very... Like... They need to create a system that is fun to use, that engages the player. This is something that Creative Assembly is just not. It's, it's a lesson that they're just not good at learning. So, sometimes they've done it, but, um, oh god, it's painstaking. Alright, 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 so... They're coming at us from four different angles. What we could do is just charge out on one, or just wait for them to come up. Part of the problem here is we've got loads of melee infantry and they've got loads of archers, so range is going to be a problem. In terms of um, which towers to use, the piercing tower here, I believe that's warp lightning, and I think that one there is... Um, I think it is rattling missiles, but I'm not entirely sure, because that is a shit ton of damage. I think we should use the lightning tower because it's more accurate. Which means we, we need to buy time. Leadership's not great. We hold on to this. This will give us a bit of extra leadership. But unfortunately, that's just not a good position to hold. I'll be completely surrounded on all sides. Yeah, very much not good. Whereas, if I stand here... They'll attack us from essentially two sides. There's pretty much nothing I can do about that. Alright, we're going to need rats to spread out. Because, yeah, one of the problems with this map here is that you can get very cramped. And we've got Night Runner Slings, which they're going to have a hard time shooting. Very hard time shooting. There we go. If you stand there, then they just shoot over your head. What, what? Yes, yes. Yeah, we just do the best we can. Another option is to just build loads of tier 1 towers. That can work. Because, yeah, Wood Elf units don't have that much health. But I, the, the tier 1 towers, they're just shit. It's only 100 damage a shot. But this one here is so much extra. Right, how about this? Don't worry about that one. If they come up through here, I'll just deal with it. Okay. we got to get this tower developed quickly. Okay, luckily that didn't do a ton of damage. Just, yeah, I found that just holding one position is better than spreading yourself thin and getting wrecked everywhere. If you stop, blob them up, you should be okay. Yeah, that's going to be difficult to do. 
because they're spread out, and this this map here is not the best. Nice runners. Come on, I need towers. It's still gonna take 90 seconds. Getting closer. Alright, pop this down here, and maybe just... Oh, I've also got a nuke. And a warp bomb. Hmm. Maybe. The night runners aren't doing too bad there. Night runners. I think I should have ordered more menace belows. Leadership on some of our guys. That's not something bad at all. Rats. Yes, superior one. Oh, don't one. tell me you can't hit that. Uh, then aim at this. Come on, just aim at something. Make sure you hit. So far, so good. I'm not seeing any serious issues here. Good, that's doing some serious damage. We'll be ready for our other one in a moment. Our tail is yours. Yeah, yeah, use the fucking bloody... Docking areas. Warhammer 3 has more dockable areas. Ah, oh, piece of crap. Sat right in front of them and didn't shoot. Piece of shit. What? What? Orders? That's ready to be warp bombed. Get in. Quick! Quick! Clan rats. Do it. Retreat! Our tiles yours. Clan rat spears. Night runners. Yes, yes. Oh shit! I'm ready to do this? Die, die, die! For the vermin tide. Our tail's yours. <laughs> Fuck you! Scarpa, go! Look, see, they run. 
I think that's just won us the battle. What about killing this one here with the... Doesn't seem like I can hit. Chance we could shoot this dude here. It doesn't just it just doesn't shoot at what I want it to. What what? Very good, master. Great Anaka. Great, great, yes. For the famine tide. What what? Good, lots of damage on that. I can make a push to try to reclaim this, this will give us some good stats bonuses. Try to kill this dude here. You? Go and recap this if you can. Or well, maybe over here. Maybe over here. Except with that one. Towers are doing pretty well. I just hold one. Skaven! Yes, yes! I'm now ready. Horned rats will. Skaven, yes, yes! Gutter runners! Captains, come on! I think we're, I think we're gonna. Yes. Yeah, we did. We did. We won. Good. 
We actually managed to save all of our territory. How about that? Huh. Looks like I didn't actually need my regiments of renown after all. I should just use them for a cleanup job, I guess. Yeah, it would be good if we can kill this lord. That, that'd be for sure. Oh no, that guy is their faction leader, so... That would just give us a lot of food, which is definitely good. Hey, you're shooting your own troops! It's okay, it doesn't kill them. It's worth it if we kill him. Legend, I didn't buy the Warhammer 3 yet. Do you think I missed a great game so far? Or did I do the right thing to wait for it? Getting more mature. Please answer honestly. Thanks, Legend. Um, it's That's very hard to answer one way or another. Warhammer 3 is a mixed game, right? You may have enjoyed it. You also may not have enjoyed it. I don't know you, though. So I don't know what you like and what you don't like. So it's really hard for me to say. Um, some, like, a lot of... Warhammer 3 split the the Warhammer fan base. That's its biggest problem. It's not completely loved. It's not completely hated. It's split. Some, yeah. Some, some people like Realms of Chaos. Some people hate it. Some people like Immortal Empires. Some people don't really like Immortal Empires. Um, you have to make a judgment call whether or not what you see is what you want. So, it's just, um, I can't answer that for you. I wish I could just say, yeah, it's a great game, go and buy it. I wish I could, but that's, uh, it's just not that simple. Looks pretty similar to Warhammer 2. Well, it's the same game, really. Warhammer 1, 2, and 3 are all the same game. It's just, like, it's an updated version of Warhammer 2. Ooh, more rocket boots. Um, I'm actually going to go with... I mean, I barely even used that one. I'm going to go with this. So we got a revolt at the vaults, and that is fine. Hey, of doom. Okay. Warlock Master of Scryer. Good, get that back up to full strength. Knows who is boss. And cancel that now. Yeah, one bit of experience can make a big difference with units that have really low leadership. It could be the difference between victory and defeat sometimes. Yeah. Crazy. Can finish that one off. Good. Oh, my money! Oh, because we recruited Storm Vermin. Address me as Sea Lord. Master. How's the 24 hour stream going? You tired yet? Oh, yeah, I'm tired. I got six hours left to go. This warlock hunts blood. I am tired. How much Red Bull you want? I don't drink Red Bull. Ugh. I have to adjust my aircon. I'm getting hot again. Man, six more hours. Alright, looks like we're okay to go and capture Canels. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, and we'll actually bring Trip over here. 
and he can finish his recruiting right next to Canels. That way, if I need him, I've got him. Ooh, two more turns. Of... All right, I'm not supposed to have this in the army. Address me as Sea Lord. You can have him instead. Clan Scryer. Why wolf rat stack? Um, it is a reward for having reached. It, it's a stream reward for having reached our goal for the devoted to dash hound um, goal for the charity. Um, so we got a doggo stack. Oh, he ran out of movement. Oh, never mind. Same thing with the Storm Vermin army. It's a reward for you guys. I will pump it up. Because I want to try to hold on to it. Whew. Okay. So we need this and this and this. Oh, okay. More warpstone armor. I haven't really been equipping all the stuff around. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. So we got a rebellion incoming here. Yeah, tax it now. Okay, here's something we could potentially do. Rather than rush back to Vulture Mountain. We could go to Lashiek. I could probably ruin dwell that. Just leave it at tier one. That being said, this is a relatively expensive army. I really shouldn't be ruin dwelling with it. For unimportant settlements, that is. All right, definitely take this one out. Don't want that hero surviving. What you need is plenty of Barbary juice plus honey plus rose water. This is Persian drink and it's delicious and beneficial for your health when you are so tired, legend. Um, that sounds really nice, and if that was on offer for me right now, I'd definitely take it up, but what I have right now is sleep deprived. <laughs> yeah. Most people don't stay up this late, long playing a game, but you know, I'll persevere. Alright, 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 alright. I could disband this, it'd be kind of a waste of those resources, those regiments of renown, but money's not great. Another thing is that there were dwarfs around here, so if this army gets wiped out, I don't really care, but let's, let's do something, rather than nothing, let's do something. Right, I'm gonna get another assassin here, I just want to keep an eye on stuff over there. Call me me, death master. And looking at other heroes we can potentially recruit. No, no, no. Oh god, I don't get any of the traits that I want. <laughs> That's why it's... I, I do like the save character mechanic. It's not efficient to do this, but we're not, we're not in any danger of losing, so it's fine. Oh shit, maybe I shouldn't have wasted that much money. Alright, we got incoming towards Karak Azor. That's not good. This is an easy battle. Yeah, that's way too many casualties for what is this garbage. Um, I have to fight this manually. That's that's total crap auto resolve. Whew. Legend, which scale of faction would you recommend for a first time player? Clan Scryer.
Uh, or maybe even Clan Moors. Clan Moors is like melee infantry. Typically speaking, melee infantry is favoured by newer players because it's quite easy to use. And usually newer players like to get in close and just watch people duke it out. Medium casualties, it says. Medium casualties. Won the battle so quick, the reinforcements didn't even show up. I had a minute left to go. Any traits or way to get more wins of magic, Escaven? Um, the only way to get more wins of magic is just have more wizards in your army. Just seeing them run around like this. It's not like it really matters. We gotta, gotta make sure we're gonna be okay. That's interesting. That guy standing there will actually sort of prevent them from coming through here. Uh, Alright, Vectique, time to get redlined. Kind of feel like I should just go into ambush dance here and just wait for them to come over this way, maybe? Clan Eshin assassinate! Sure. Is there anyone there? Yeah, there's 13 units sitting there, so I kind of need Vectique to get on with it. Oh, 
Everyone knows I'm greatest. Yeah, take it out. Take it out. If I go into ambush dance this close to them, they'll probably detect me. Best thing I think for me to do is stand here. That way, if this one comes over and tries to attack, and this one comes at me, I do have the option to withdraw back to here. Since I couldn't reach him, it seems unlikely he could reach me. Good. Begin the summoning. Alright, what do we got here? Yep, don't need that. Any new enemies? No? I guess that's good. Alright, 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 we gotta get a move on it. Warlock, master of Scryer! Alright, Ike Claw. Chief Warlock, Ike Claw! Machination! Okay. Him staying in the region here doesn't stop the revolt, so just stay right. Stay right there. When the revolt shows up, we'll just, we'll just deal with it. Yep. Uh, this guy's swinging around. He, he might attack Eye of the Panther. It's not a big deal if we lose it. Don't worry. Okay, well, money's tight, so we're going to have to do something about that. Probably best I don't actually spend any money this time. Alright, I need another nuke. We used up quite a few. Oh, I've got to wait for more turns. Alright, I've done everything that I can. How many armies do we have? Six. Okay. Alright, yeah, we'll just uh, see what we can do. Alright, uh, we got some leveling up to do. This guy here can have... Yep, more red line skill. Have you played a quick campaign in your own time? If so, has Scarbrand been annoying to you? He always declares war on me pretty early when he's hard to deal with. Uh, I haven't played Queek in Warhammer 3, to be honest. Um, I don't think it's that tough of a position. Like, I've had a brief look at it, but I, I didn't feel like it was that tough. But, no, I haven't played a campaign of it myself. Best advice I could give is ambush. Ambush and shoot him. As best as you can. Because, like, your clan rats are not going to be able to deal with corn warriors and... And, um... Uh, skull... Blood letters here. Yeah. Alright, let's move on. Are the dogs awake? Uh, yeah, they would be. Make this quick, fast, I'm. Sorry, it's Greg. No, can't do it. I'm strength ranking too. He's in grind mode, dialing in. Yeah, I'm pretty tired. I'm, I'm gonna grind through. I'll be alright, but it's really hard to be energetic at this point. Really, really tough. Do the best I can to try and stay energetic, but... Oh, oh, I don't... I don't have much. Stop, 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 stop. Good. Sorcerer's Island's only rank 1. I didn't invest any food into that, so that's fine. Oh, What are you doing? Seems silly. Okay. 
Oh, I see what he's doing here. He's put himself in a position so that Clan Angren can, can attack and he'll reinforce. Which they didn't go for it anyway. Is that a new headset? Yeah, my other one broke. Um, the wire um, split. Couldn't hear from it anymore. It was a good set of headphones, but... I fiddled with the wires too much, and um, they got worn out. Because I'm a massive fiddler. Kitty fit. No. <laughs> no, I had to stop myself there. Congrats on your 10 years on YouTube. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. Have you heard about the MP controversy? Do you think this will affect overall interest? Uh, I have heard about it. I'm aware of it. Um, I don't care, for one thing, because I don't play multiplayer. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, do that. It's only six turns. We'll survive. And that's worth how much money? Yeah, I mean, it's, it's interesting. It's interesting. Um... Creative Assembly should fix it, for sure. This isn't something that should be buried and that a handful of people should know about it. They'll ruin it for everyone else. This was part of the problem with drop hacking back in 2016. I was a big part of trying to get rid of drop hacking when I actually played multiplayer. A select few people would drop hack, right? right? And what that is is they're losing a battle in multiplayer and they would alt F4 out of the game at just the right time so that the other player didn't realize that they were drop, dropping out and not taking a loss, right? And what I did was I showed people how to do it. And then the multiplayer community was like, hey, don't tell people how to do it, now everyone's gonna do it. And I was like, yes, that's the point. If everybody does it, it's fair, right? Okay, because people were already doing it before I showed it. And um, I showed it, then everyone started doing it, and Creative Assembly fixed it. And that's what needs to happen. Everybody should do it. Everybody in the multiplayer, cheat. Okay, if it's a, if some if one person is doing it, everyone should do it. Fucking cheat. Okay, Creative Assembly will then fix it. Problem goes away. But yeah, trying to bury the information so that so that it doesn't become widespread is the no. It you know, it really is quite endemic within the Total War community to do that kind of shit. Um. It's not how we solve it. And if you want multiplayer to survive, it has to get better. You can't just keep making it shit. Where are my schematics? But I personally don't give a fuck about, about the system. If Creative Assembly don't fix it, I don't care. Because it's a multiplayer problem and I don't care. Well, I can't take on both. Alright, there, there is no way that this army here is going to launch the attack straight away. In fact, it might not even launch the attack next turn. So, we should get rid of Ark in the Black. Because, yeah, he will, he will probably just straight die. Because, here is the thing. I think that multiplayer is very important to Total War. I also think that Creative Assembly don't do a good job of multiplayer, like developing it. Oh my god! <laughs> Poor guy. Uh, but I do, even though I don't personally play the multiplayer side of things, I, I think I don't play the multiplayer because it's not, for me, very engaging. Like, if there was a um, Avatar Conquest mode... Avatar Conquest was peak multiplayer. I, I played a little bit of Avatar Conquest, and I really liked it. Um, and ever since playing Avatar Conquest, everything else just pales in comparison. I just, I just can't be fucked with it, right? Um, let me just see... 
Scamper, scamper! We'll still replenish. I can make my way down to Wizard Caliph's Palace where there is no army. I think that's his last settlement. But I also don't want to lose this settlement. It's, we're not we're not urgently needing to do that, so force march to here. They're, they're unlikely to launch the attack there and we'll hit them next turn. But yeah, if they added Avatar Conquest for Warhammer 3, I might have actually participated but like domination mode i could not give a fuck about domination mode i like i i watch a couple of battles of domination mode and i just think it's just fucking crap i have no interest in it whatsoever it's just so stupid for me personally some people like it i see a lot of people like it and that that's great but i i would never touch that crap And I remember when we were in early access for Warhammer 3, and um, Creative Assembly was really trying to push hard to get everyone to like cover domination mode. I was just like, no, why should I cover it? It's not going to be good for me. Who knows, maybe that's maybe they got upset with me over that. I don't know. Oh, big garrison there right too. Channel fight chaos. Garrison. An impossible path. All right, just hang back here in ambush dance. We'll see if we can goad them down this way. I just can't really justify going at them. Would this army be able to take massive... No, definitely not. Like, that, that's going to require both armies to sort out. Definitely require both. What is Avatar Conquest? Um, it's just a way more in-depth um, multiplayer mode, which was only available in Shogun 2. It kind of made sense that it was, like, easier to implement in Shogun 2 because there is essentially only one race to play, which is, you know, J Japanese, with various different variations. You know, the variety differences between the different clans in Shogun 2 is equivalent to the differences. It, in fact, it's smaller than the differences between, like, fucking Reichland and Golden Order. But it was good, like you you had an avatar like a lord and as you won multiplayer battles he would level up but as he gained like skills he would become more expensive so if you wanted to have a really good general you'd have a smaller army. So it was balanced, it wasn't a case of if you had a level 5 general um, that you would just beat everyone that was level 1, that wasn't necessarily the case, it just gave you more options. Typically speaking, higher level generals would win, though. Oh, my ears are getting sore. Alright, what am I doing out here? You. You wait right there for Vectik to come down and you'll reinforce him. As for you, I want you to take Karak and Gazar. Crap. <laughs> well, I just gotta hope I don't get caught because um, I think we would seriously struggle with that. Your chance of ambushing is 75%. Well, we'll, just, we'll see. Um, this is a very replaceable army. These things happen. 
I'm trying to get my mom into Warhammer. Do you have any advice that worked on Mrs. Legend? Not it didn't work on Mrs. Legend. She's not interested in this game. I got her into Valheim because she likes those kind of games. Now what am I doing? I say, say, move. Hmm. Alright, I need you to wipe out Marius Leakdorf here. This will actually kill him, assuming he's gonna win. Ambush success chance is 100%. Can we auto resolve it? Yeah, I've tried many times to get my wife into Total War. She's, it doesn't take. She's just not interested in it. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, come on. Ah, I have to fight manually. Domination fixes the you lost that army pick problem. What's not to like? Um. Yeah, I don't... Yeah, okay. Um, I guess I just don't like the actual way that it plays out. It's like capture the flag, or what is it called, like capture points. I don't like that in a battle. I don't like capture points. So that's my problem with it. If it was just like a battle where you had to destroy the or route the enemy army, I, I that's what I like to do. I am not interested in capture the flag. I don't want to play that at all. And that's fine if some people want to play that. Not a problem with it whatsoever. But I do not want to play Capture the Fucking Flag. Okay. For me, that is not what battles are about. Battles are about killing or routing your enemy by any means necessary. Not capture the flag and gain points and then revive oh, dead yeah. characters and lords and, car and units. No. I... You know, survival battles are silly. Uh, I'm just not interested in them. Again, totally fine if you are. But yeah, domination mode was not made for me. And I'm okay with that, you know, it's just a matter of taste and it's just not my taste. Oh no, my general! Scipio Africanus has captured our flag! And has spawned in three units of legionnaires! Quick, we must summon up our elephant reserves from the nether. <laughs> we scour treble. <laughs> Clan rats. Napoleon Bonaparte has captured a bridge and has summoned in 500 units of artillery. Rattling gun. Ready, ready. <laughs> Not interested. Archeon the Everchosen has captured Middenheim and summoned a massive portal and destroyed the entire world. <laughs> Some of you will know what I'm talking about. They put so much effort into domination mode. Surely you should just give it a chance. Did you ever play Total Arena? Did you ever play Total Arena? That's how you do it correctly, okay? Total War Arena is how you do it correctly. Did you know in Total Arena? If you lost your unit, it's fucking dead, right? You're fucking out, right? <laughs> um, in order to win the battle, you have to, like, you can win via score, right? You can win via score, or you kill the entire army. Uh, if you want to play, like, a domination mode that was done right, Total War Arena did it correctly. Total War Arena is the best multiplayer experience that you can have for Total War, I think. 
Do you know what killed Total War Arena? Shit development. Great idea, shit development. weird with Total Arena. I think they just tried way too hard to like make it a free to play, pay to win sort of game. It might have actually been better if they, like I just don't think the Total War community falls for that kind of shit. I think that they m might have been better just making it a pay to play game. That might have actually worked. Problem is, there's quite a few games out there that are free to play that make like a lot of money, and I think they just tried to do that with Total Arena. So I just, I just don't think the Total War community goes for that kind of shit. Then they like try to sell it to China, and then there's that Elysium stuff as well. It's just like, god damn, so many failed ventures into China. What the hell was Elysium anyway? I mean, I know it's a card game, but why? You know what was funny, right? Um, I don't know if I should be talking about this. But when we first started playing Total War Arena, this was probably 2015. This was before all of my major controversies. Did you know that when I would play it, all the other players would just draw swastikas everywhere? <laughs> but when I fucking do it, oh, then everyone's got a goddamn problem. <laughs> They would write the n-word, like, because you could, like, write while the game was loading. We would just write the n-word. It'd just be n-word, 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 n-word. And there'd be a guy in the in the chat, in your match, and he would just be calling his teammates n-words. Oh, you n-word, go and do that, you n-word. Oh, it just feels full of it. I'm not. I'm not saying that that, beh that behavior is appropriate. By the way, I'm just saying it was there. Because you're an influencer, dude. I know. I'm just. I'm just joking. I. It's fine. Well, because I'm an influencer, I gotta actually behave myself. What kind of shit double standard is that? <laughs> so what you're telling me is that you guys could do whatever the fuck you want. But I have to behave myself. What kind of shit rule is that? Uh, I really want Marius Leapdorf to die, but I don't want to go that way. Warlock, master of Alright, just go back into Ambush Dance and head over here. We've Let's got to clear this forward. out. Basically Mordhau now. Yeah, I never got into Mordhau, but yeah, I've heard it's horrible. Chief Warlock. Master Engineer.
But no, apart from apart from like the very rare behavior with Turtle Arena, it was a good game. I enjoyed it. Uh, maybe Marius will make his way down here, because his turn comes before theirs, but we'll see. Alright, any new enemies? I think we're done with this turn. Alright, where's the Sword of Cain, and why isn't it making its way over to me? We've got to hurry up with this, because I do not want to go over time. What I think we need to do is take these two armies. This will be done next turn. Take these two armies. Take Massive Orkar. Make our way up through here. We'll have to go over to Slanesh territory. Once we land here, Avalon will start sending forces at us. Thing is, though, landing here is red territory. Not good for us, but you know, do what we can. Got to get some money in the meantime. All right, I've got. Rolling doom. Okay, just wait. Yep, upgrade that and that, and maybe just save the rest of that money up. How are we going for heroes? Did I already check this turn? No, no, no. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm glad it's cheap, if nothing else. Goodness, discipline! Okay. Oh, hang on. Has it been rough? Uh, you know, you fight a lot of battles. That's why that's why it takes so long to get through it. Because you fight a lot of enemies. That's just how it is. See, normally if you play a campaign, you're not at war with everyone, and therefore you're not fighting like 20 battles every turn. Or you don't have to try so hard in every single battle. I can smell your terror mask. <laughs> All right, just a little bit of update on the charities. We're almost up to thirteen thousand with the oh no 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 okay uh, with the extra life stuff. Appreciate that, guys. Um, the Daxand charity is up to five thousand two hundred thirty-eight. Good job, guys. And. We're up to 2,696 for uh, the Forces Society. Wow, you guys did great with that. Absolutely smashed that goal. Oh, no. <laughs> uh, that's not good. Because that means that we're going to be in full view of, um, of Clan Angrant. Well, look, I might as well fight this. But ah, god damn it! I can't believe he walked right into it. We were not in his path. Why do I feel like CA will do to the food system what they did to the slave system? No, I don't think so. The food system is not heavily criticized. Like, um, yeah, it's like twenty k donated. Uh, let me let me just confirm that. So thirteen plus five is 18 oh yeah 20 20 thousand dollars nice good job yes should i just let them leave the battlefield 
If I just let them leave the battlefield, they'll probably get wiped out. Because, yeah, we need to be in best shape we possibly can for the next fight. Just, just let them leave. I'll cast some spells on them and just let them leave. Because, yeah, we are definitely going to be fighting Clan Engren. I don't think there's any avoiding that. Just let them leave. <laughs> yeah, they pretty much always leave. Get out of there. Just let them go. lost any moment now so what I'm thinking here is that when they get army lost run down Marius Leapdorf make sure he doesn't get away Legend and Valheim is silver equipment worth over iron? Yep. Yep. All all weapon upgrades are worth it because armor can save your life. And it doesn't cost anything to repair it. So yeah, it's always worth it to upgrade your armor. Always. It's a really good system that they've got in um, Valheim. I've had headphones on for so long now, my ears are really itchy. Yeah, I've seen this happen before. There's too many of our units and they actually can't engage with them properly. Happy 40th birthday, Legs. I'm not 40. Uh, it's the 10th anniversary of the channel today. Uh, it's not my birthday. My birthday is in March. You know, I'll turn 18 in March. <laughs> so we just want to get some of our guys out of here so we can actually run him down. Just some of them. Keep swarming him. Okay, that's working now. See you, Marius. I was disappointed with the mislands personally. I kind of am with you with that. Yeah. Um, this the the mis well not necessarily. Okay, so the misland equipment, like armor and stuff, is a bit disappointing because it can only be upgraded once as opposed to three times. So it's not much of an upgrade over um, the previous set. But magic's pretty good. Have you tried out blood magic? Blood magic's good. Um, I think the uh, the problem with mistlands that I think a lot of people are having is that um, it's incredibly difficult to navigate the mistlands like the previous biome plains it's just like wide open plains you see what's coming you can see anything from a mile away unless there's fog um, and so it's really easy to navigate mistlands so hard to navigate cliffs everywhere sharp drops water everywhere fog mist you can't see shit um, things come out of nowhere and fucking kill you. It's super dangerous. It's such a huge step up from difficulty compared to, um... Yeah, I'm gonna need that. This meat uh, flesh will do nicely. Such a huge step up from difficulty compared to planes.
This is because of Marius lead off. Yeah. Back off. Please, please don't make me have to fight that one. Please. Oh my god. Oh my god, it survives. I can't believe they had enough movement. What were they? Oh, what a miracle. What a miracle. Man, they had me. They had me by my balls. I found this land super fun so far. It's mixed. It's mixed. It, it is. It, it's fun if you know what you're doing, but I can understand people thinking it's frustrating. Fight me. Die in pain. Pain. Have you played Dark Tide or generally not interested in it? Um. So Dark Tide, bit of a weird feeling between that. Um, I like Vermin Tide in short bursts, right? So I imagine that I will like Dark Tide in short bursts. However, there are other games right now that I would just rather play. Damn it. Oh, Valiant Defeat. Give it a shot. Give it a shot. Um, so yeah, it's just a case of there are other games right now that I'd rather play and... Yeah, that, that, that really is all there is to it. Worst part about Mislands is the fog for me. Yeah. It's a challenge. Necromunda? I haven't played it. Screw monetization in Dark Tide. Fat Shark are being way too greedy. Yeah, look, I don't know, man. I don't know. Nuke? Potentially, yeah. Alright, this is actually a fairly good defensive position, because they're going to take forever to get to, to the back all the way here. And we've got a tower that can shoot them. Two towers. Um, the other one being over there. Okay. What, what ordered? So... What, what? How we do this? How we do this? All right, it's gonna take them some time to get here. Our tail's yours. So I could set up some basic towers just to thin them out a little bit, but I think it would be best save up, get the get the tier four tower. Let's get the tier four tower going. Yeah, let's really fuck them up. Feather cape is a must. Um, I've been able to survive without a feather cape. I wouldn't say it's a must. It definitely helps, for sure. Thing is, the feather... The feather cape is incredibly expensive. Like, getting 20 refined eyedra, that's not quick. That's not a quick thing. You need to firstly get five dark cores in order to make the item refinery. Then you need to get 23 sap, three sap for the um, refinery, and then 20 for the um, refined ore, uh, either. And then you need to get 20 um, soft tissue, which means you have to find a skull, or you kill a lot of gray dwarfs. Gray, gray dwarfs, um, dervishers. Why do I keep calling them gray dwarfs? In which game there is no toxic community? I haven't seen any element of toxicity within the Valheim community yet. But that being said, I'm I'm only like ankle deep at the moment. I, look, in typ typically speaking, the Total War community is pretty good. It's it's pretty well behaved. Even the Reddit is pretty reasonable sometimes. Yeah, I've been pretty impressed with the Reddit over the past few weeks. Because I had a massive hate boner for the Reddit earlier this year. But um, the past few weeks, I saw a lot of reasonable sort of behavior. And any toxic behavior was downvoted to shit. So I was pretty happy with that. Oh, shit. <laughs> Maybe I should fucking build the thing that I need. Tower. I'm tired. Go 
quick. Block them off. That way they'll have to go all the way back around. Or try to get through it. They try to get through it. Fucking nuke them. Because that's a lot of them. Oh my god, yeah, they're just gonna go back around. <laughs> See you later. Alright. Yeah, yes, Master Lord. Alright, what you want with Raparts is have her fight our weakest unit, because she's friggin' tough, and try to get rid of her army. I think trying to hit her with rattling missiles is maybe a little bit of a waste now, of time. Ready. Move, move. For the famine time. Council's command. Move, move. Okay, funnel them all through one area here if possible. That'll make the rattling missile really effective. Retreat, retreat. Kill, kill. Oh, they shot through it. Okay. Yeah. We just we just got to um She's just gonna kill too many of them. You gotta kill off her army. Now, ready now. Clan rats. Clan rat spears. Retreat, retreat. Guide us, horned one. I think I should have gone with the Warp Lightning. This uh, Rattling Missile is really inaccurate. Does good damage though. What, what hold us? Hasten, hold. See if I can do this without using a nuke. Oh, we, we still got a lot of units coming in. It's fine if they're shooting at this and they're not shooting at us, it buys us some time. The 
I don't, know, don't get into a blob with her. Your, your desire. Guide us on to one. Clan rats. This is death. What? What? Orders. Our tail is yours. Tail tall. Clan rats. Bring them back over here. Back underground. Go back over here. These choke points actually benefit them greatly. Still got a nuke if I absolutely need it. Just hoping that I don't need it. Good, that summon unit here just took out a lot of that infantry unit, not all the whole thing. Ready, ready! To die things. They flee! We run! They run! Scarpa, go! We run! Come on, wrap that one before um, before it expires. Ah, too late. Alright, that's it for my menace belows. Let's just hope that was enough. Alright, we've got incoming coming from over here. Gotta stop that. Could you push through here and try to run that one down? That would be really handy if you could do that. Don't bother trying to shoot at Rapants. It's not accurate. I definitely don't think I should have gone with um, with this tower. I should have gone with the more accurate version. That was cheaper. Skaven! Yes! Yes! Get him, get him. Oh my god. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. For the burning tide. Rocky Jazz. Oh, she's got so many kills. Clan rat spears. Now, ready now. Guide us, horned one. Guide us, horned one. All right, I got a bit of a problem forming up over here. Bit of a problem. You stay over there. Okay, let's get this going. That'll take a little while, but just do your best. Clan rats! 
Not even halfway through Rapunzel's health yet. Okay, that one's shattered. Charge into the rear of this. Oh, we got a problem here. We got a problem. Rapunzel's eaten through the last of her infantry. That's a good hit. She starts capping this here, we're in big trouble. I need to bring some of these back. Oh, I fucking broke. Oh no. Oh no. It's a nice looking blob though. What what? Ready, ready. Night runners. At, at once. Our, our, our tail's yours. Faster, scurry. Faster, scurry. Just charge at him. The um the night runners. Quick, quick. Should be able to beat them in melee. Not move. Just try to keep Rapants out of once, the town square where possible. Tyson, hurry! What what? They've blobbed up, so they're not going to fire well. Guide us on, one. Quick, go and cap another point just in case we lose this. You can't army loss for parts. Oh no, she's unbreakable. <laughs> well, I, let's get rid of her other units. Oh shit. Well then, I need towers to take her out. I can't think of any other way. Okay, she's gonna go cap this, but we're about to cap this spot here. I didn't realize she was unbreakable. Far away is that? No way, you can run through that. Skaven, yes, yes. Council's command. Murder, kill, kill. Clan rats. Yeah, look how many kills she got. I, I don't have anything that's good against her in this army. None, nothing. Um, but it's not over. If we can manage to cap points faster than her. <laughs> Somehow. Oh god. I'm running on like mega fumes here. These are gonna get blown up in any second, yeah. Yeah, the only way we're gonna get her is by um through towers. It's the only way. Just keep running, capping whatever points we can. Don't engage her. <laughs> I didn't realize she was unbreakable. I just have to hope I don't get army lost here. 
Well, Rapunzel's army is gone. So that's something. Yeah, just try and keep her busy as long as possible. While we cap other points. Stop breaking. I need someone to get back over here because I need the leadership. Could you please rally? You got 13 leadership. Don't run away. Stop. Stop. Okay. okay yeah, I need you to get over here. Did they get army lost? No. I need supplies. Come on, guys. Get over there. I need you to cap this point back. It could work. It's actually doing damage. Uh, get back, get back, get back. She's coming back over this way. But if I run back over here, she'll probably go back over that way. Now, move! Tyson, hurry! Where's she going? Move, oh no, she's going move. that way. Okay, that's fine. That's right she wants to cap this one. Captains, come on! Slake, slake! Good. Keep going. Keep capping points. I need supplies. Not gonna work. That's okay. That tower is not associated with that position. Our tail's yours. She never capped this one. We haven't hit her in a while. Where are you going? Where are you going? Why are you going this way? Go, go a different way. Go a different way. We don't want to fight her. to get to. Go that way. Just split up. You go back over this way. Okay, you're gonna have to... Um, no, just keep running. Just keep running. I'll just build barricades and just everything everywhere. Everything everywhere. That's the way. It is the way. Come on. Don't engage her. This is pointless. Try to lure her into a position, yeah, where that can actually hit her. Night runners. What, what holders? Night runners. Spears. The fuck do we get to this position on, here? Scary, yes. I go all the way around that way. Breaking out. Creature in a car. No, you can't go that way, you're gonna go down that way. <laughs> Through there. What 
Don't, don't fight over here. Oh my god, is that working? Ready, ready. Oh, good idea, good idea. Run through here. She can't follow. Buys time. And what we do is, if she runs around here, then we just run back through here. We just, we play Ring Around the Rosie. <laughs> For the tide. Oh, she wants to cap it. It's okay, we're doing damage to her. She's, she's going down. He's going down. Okay, you get to the right of there. Night runners. Shit. Victory's in our grasp. Well, that's good. We just gotta hit her a few more times. Ready, yeah, ready. this tower here. She's running along this way. I reckon if we stand our ground got, here, yes. we just need this tower to hit her a couple of times and she's gone. into her explosion, so just try to be in the middle of that. A few more hits, a few more hits. This one here will rally as well. The vast majority of shots will miss her. Back over here, get nice and close. She's going for the capping point. And she's going to succeed. Destroyed that one. That's okay. We just got to set up another one. <laughs> Another couple here and there. Going this way, okay. How, how did 50 damage in two minutes? Yeah, but we've almost won. 
I, we can't beat her head on, so all I can hope to do is win by the towers. It's the only thing I can do. She's just, she's just too strong. Look, she's done 33,000 damage. I can't, can't get these Skaven to fight her. Oh, I think she's stuck in a loop. She doesn't know what to do. Yeah, she's stuck in a loop. She doesn't know what to do. <laughs> she's like, oh shit, I've only got 300 health left. She can't win now. Even if she fights this, she can't win. She's just waiting to get hit. That's it. Bring him in. Which might as well just fight her. She's got 37 health. We, we can do that to her. <laughs> I can't believe it actually won. Without using a nuke as well. Would have been a lot easier if I did use a nuke. Damn, so much time has passed. I've got less than five hours now to get the Sword of Cain. <laughs> I've just spent like an hour on that battle. Send, send them away. Oh really? They're back again? Oh, because they never built the public order building. That's good. It actually weakens their position. Oh boy, okay, so... They still have an army there. Yeah. Maybe we can take that out. Well, we know Belagar's there. I don't think this army can handle that. It's too much. Okay, we now have a full army of Stormburn. On the porch is back. Ready to kill, kill. Sneaks coming. Right. That that will work. 
Night runner. We're gonna find a way to get in there. Chief Warlock, it can This will easily ambush, I think. Best weapons. Engineer of Scryer. Alright, just get to Eye of the Panther. There's no urgency in taking her out. Because, yeah, we got to deal with uh, this dude now. Or that one. I actually should be able to make it there. A single turn. Could take that out. This one could My go for Martek. Me. No. Yes. No. No. Hang on, if I stand here. Just stand right there, he won't be able to walk through. We'll take a defensive position. Yeah. I won't be able to go into ambush dance, I think. But that'll be okay. Which kill device do you use? Oh shit, nearly max food again. Okay. I don't think he's got any other armies because we've taken out quite a few of them. So we'll just have to see how that goes. We'll just have to stay there. Um, Diabolic devices. Let's take out Karak Buftar down here. Turn them to rat fodder. Hex attack. Oh, I wasn't expecting that to be such a good victory. Okay. And this one comes in and assists. Just make an easier order resolve. Fewer casualties. Oh crap. Vectik could now go over here and finish recruiting his army. Disband this. This will save us a lot of money because we're going to need it next turn when we recruit these other units. Uh, we're probably going to lose Vorak. I can't see any way around that. Actually, if I put this army in here... Might be able to beat Belagar because these ones could just keep capping points. Just, we just, yeah, maybe win against him that way. Because dwarves are really bad at attacking settlements. Minor settlement sieges are really bad at it. Oh, there's going to be a rebellion. But the defenses here, okay, it, it'll hold. It, it'll be fine. Still no sign of the Sword of Cain. Any new enemies? No. And then maybe what we'll do with Vectik is jump him over here. Well, but then there's nobody defending this area out this way. Magic's energy. Bit of a weird thing that they did there. Looks like we'll have to fight that manually. And I think, I'm not really too concerned about this one just gaining experience, I just want to get the win. So if they're just going to run off the battlefield, just let them do that.
Do you think the next Warhammer game will be end times? I don't think so. No. Yeah, just let them leave the battlefield. You guys sit over. Oh god, you sit there. Sit there. <laughs> They're on forced march. I won't gain any experience, but it's merely a case of deleting their armies. Excuse me. This is a good item. <laughs> oh, army wiped out. You got stack wiped, boy. I wonder. I wonder. Master Engineer. What if? What if I did that to Beligar and he just ran off the battlefield? Not my miscalculation. No, no. <laughs> yeah. Uh. <laughs> All right, let's have a look here. Got any cunning dudes? I need some more rum. It's more ambush success chance, so that gives us 70%. Let's only get a few tries of this. <laughs> I don't know. They might just walk off the battlefield. So what we'll do here is we'll aim specifically for the artillery. We just like... Fuck their artillery and then get out and just see if they'll walk off the battlefield. Uh, Xenophar did a PLN 50 super sticker. Thanks, dude. Appreciate the support. Yeah, we can actually totally win that. Right, move back. Quick, quick! Very well, attack!
And let's just see what they do now. <laughs> yeah, they're just gonna leave. Uh, that's pretty funny. Alright, kill this one. This is why we chose the magic damage. Look at that, they just delete that dude. Yeah, he's not coming back. Won't be seeing you next time, fucker. Close defeat, it said. What have I said? Like, Skaven shit all over the dwarves. The dwarves just can't handle them. How are we going with the uh, donations we'll win? We've hit 13,138 for um, Extra Life for Johns Hopkins Children's Center. For the Daxons, we're at two five, sorry, five two five eight, And for the Fawcett Society, we're up to, up to 3,000. Wow. Mayo EFK did a two hundred dollar donation there. You guys have been super generous. I just recover all my damage. I don't know if I've got enough movement to catch him. I do. Master engineer. So you know how we just lost against that army, yep, and you know how they're pretty much at full strength, yep, and you know how we lost like half of our army, yep, well apparently we're gonna win. <laughs> Five thousand. All right, let me let me add that up. Actually, so thirteen thousand through them. That's five, eighteen. Oh, we're twenty, twenty-one thousand. That's still a massive effort. Don't get me wrong. All right, and all we have to do here is absolutely nothing. <laughs> so you know how we'll uh, be wiped out if we lose again? Yep. So we're retreating? That's right. Do you not see what's wrong with this? Nope. If we leave the battlefield, we all die. Yep. But they don't get to kill us. 
Mm. I didn't fucking program it, okay? <laughs> This, this is the extent of uh, the programming for the AI in Ambush. If Ambush Defense equals true, retreat. That's it. <laughs> Doesn't check the bounce of power. Just like, always retreats. This is one line of, line of code. <laughs> if, if Ambush Defense equals true, then retreat. <laughs> Creative Assembly looked at Warhammer 2 ambush defense AA. AI. Okay, so instead of doing nothing, how about they actively work towards their own destruction? See, in Warhammer 2, the AI just sits there when you ambush them. But in Warhammer 3, they kill themselves. It's different. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, oh, piss. Uh, I have to keep him there. He's um, low on loyalty. Warlock, master of Scryer. All right. Well, that was a good. Uh, turn of events for us. All right, uh, that looks like all we can do this turn. Master engineer. Damn, I want some more cunning heroes. Why won't you give it me? Trainer of war beasts. Good. Right, where should this go? Vectique. Should go to Vectik. Vectik's gonna be coming around over this way soon. Okay, that looks fine. Switch the edict in the promise you'll recruit next turn. That's a good idea, actually. So that's over here. Switch it over to Marshall Planning. Yep. Good idea. Good thinking. Much clever. Good. This guy here just got his immortality, so I can justify giving him whatever items I want him to have, and it's fine. Um, actually, I have Warpstone Armor. 
and you may have a hand weapon as well. How would you like a forge blade, talisman? Come on, stone. And enchanted item, you may have a. Uh, it's not very good, but you can have that. Can you still revive dead legendary lords? Yep. Yeah, most legendary lords can be revived. I'm not. I don't have a list of which ones can and can't be revived though. All right, Grey Seer of Plague. Let's make him a mentor. Vectique. Yeah. No, actually. We don't. No, no, no. Let's level, level him up a bit more first. Okay. Ichic Claw, what are you doing? Science. Sorcery. Death. Yeah, we don't need Ichic Claw to level up too much faster. Uh, Warp Smart is pretty good, but not essential. Um, yeah, another point into that should be fine. skills. We've got everything down here. Uh, guess get that. for weapons testing. <laughs> Alright. Anything else we need to do? That all seems fine. Imminent Rebellion at Karakaisor. That's fine. I can't do anything about it. Even if I exempt it from taxes, I just wasn't paying enough attention. They, this should be built. I don't think they're going to besiege. And if they do, I'll just jump Vectique over there. Many, many kills today. <laughs> Okay, let's move on. Double checking any enemies. Nope, okay, moving on. All right, we've got to get to Ulthuan. I'm only got like four hours left. Gotta get to Ulthuan. Okay, it's only Skaven, shouldn't be too bad to deal with him. The Hand of Vectic is an artifact in Warhammer Fantasy. It's a component used to summon Scarbrand in Novel Thank Wall's Doom. Yeah, yeah. Vectic. Speak before storm demon. Oh, I, I need to pay attention to what they're doing. Oh, God damn it, we've got an army. Of Orion's going down that way. Stop, 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 stop. Ah, damn it. Alright, it says close to feet. A lot of cavalry, but the Fae Enchantress is here. That's basically like having repants. So just fuck it. I'm not going to waste an hour on that. Get it. There was no way we were going to win that. Low fealty general is a research follower. It's, it's okay, he'll be fine. Defenses there are good. Alright, so Orion's coming in here. It's a pretty large army, but Castle Carcassonne is 
pretty well defended. He might go after Canels instead. Oh, both of my. Engineer, here. I will not obey. Maybe we should go take Brion back and just wait for this to be poorly defended. Alright, Vectic, you need to come over here and start building a proper army. So you get rid of all of this, that can all go. And you start getting some good units. So you get, yep, start with, you get two of those. And four of those. Oh god, that used to pull my money. Warlock of Skaven Blight. He's got loyalty now anyway. There you go. Put a stop to this one. Set suit to war, fight mode. Oh, every single time, the guy just takes so much damage. Why did you disband the? Deadweth Mor Wind Mortar and the Rattling Gunners because they're regiments of renown and they're best used as emergency units, which is why we recruited them in the first place. Um, they're very good units, but they're needed for an emergency. That's all. All right, you should probably have some stuff. It's not actually supposed to be in the army. Stephen Knight's greatest, best inventor. Make it so. Dear Scryer Schemes. Alright. Alright, you need to go take care of Kangazar. Is that it? Is that uh, all of our stuff done for the turn? Seems like it. Seek, seek target. Ashen contract approved. Against council. Clan Ashen assassinating. All right. Good. Begin the summoning. Well, I don't really have any money left for construction, so maybe don't worry about it. Don't worry about too much. And we've got plenty of this for Doom Rockets. Just got one. That's okay. The last one we got was good. Any new enemies? Yes, we have Corona. Ugh. Not one step further, stranger. You do not walk my lands without my blessing, which you don't have. Yeah, fair enough, whatever. Well, that's uh, that's going to be an obstacle, for sure. So, I think I'm, yeah, I'm strength ranking one now. 
Reichland being the next strongest that I'm aware of. Useful in the workshop. Yeah, yeah, I've still got 30 capacity for food. It's okay. Let's actually have a look. So it would be good to have to get these uh, other regiments for now. So with that, we got poison wind mortars. Um, I got the iris of the chaos moon. That would be good. And I think we just got uh, virulent plants. That's pretty good. Eyes everywhere would be good as well. Yep, let's get that going. If Wolf Rat or Storm Vermin Army gets destroyed, do you have to rebuild it? Yes, we actually lost the Rat Arm, sorry, the uh, Wolf Rat Army already, and I had to rebuild it. So I have to keep it alive, and if it gets wiped out, I have to rebuild it. That's that's the rules. <sighs> yeah, I really want to start focusing on trying to get to Ulth One. Really want to start doing that. So. Maybe something else. It's okay if they take Sorcerer's Island. It is what it is. Whatever. Easy come, easy go. It is what it is. Can't possibly hope to defend that. Do you think the mentor trait was a good addition for Lord's Heroes? Yeah, it's pretty good. Yeah. Please tell me you're at war with them. No. I don't know. God damn it. Do you know be good if we can recruit our warlords at rank 13? I can start doing the warlord cheese, which is good, great for money. We're getting fairly close to it, but we're not quite there yet. Taking the Black Pyramid would help. Assuming it would come with the vault straight away. Alright, let's have a look here. Ica Claw's been gridlocked for a while. Alright, we're... Pretty close to max food. Okay. So you need two more of those, and then the rest are placeholder rattling guns, I think. Until we get some more heroes for you. Switch that back to this. It'll, it'll still get done. I could actually make it back over there, but we'll deal with Carl Franz another time. I can make it to Aquitaine. This army here is nothing. Uh, 
Ah, but Corone's nearby. You can say They're not at war with Reichland. Well, that's that's easy, low-hanging fruit. That's for sure. Mm. Any new enemies? No. Alright, this should be an easy win over here. Scurry forward! Kidding me, man. This, this is terrible in auto resolve. There's no way we're going to struggle with that. Oh. Do I sometimes play Vermintide 2? Not really. I haven't played it in probably a year. Yeah, I think it's been more than a year since I played it. Like, I like it, but it's not something that I play regularly. Root Horror Army is terrible in order resolve as well. Yeah, that's true. Okay, well... Okay, here's how we do this. We get these groups and go straight for the, um, the missile units. I think these are managing. They're actually doing really well against this. <coughs> they did really well. I wasn't expecting that. It's a Pyrrhic victory. I absolutely slaughtered them. Agent, how are you holding up and how much more to go in terms of time? Uh, we've got just over four hours to go. Uh, I'm managing. I'm very tired, but I'm managing. Uh, we've got enough that we can justify going tier three. Make under Empire bigger. Something might come over here and attack us, and if it does, we'll just deal with it. Master Engineer. Okay. Council. Yeah. 
precise voice. Warlock master. Oh yeah, plus there's freaking dirty here. Yeah. yeah, going back over here right now would be a mistake. There's three legendary lords right there. Address me as Sia Lord. Warpstones. Drink, Steven Blue. Attack, die for Honed Rat. Which Chaos faction are less dependent to Champions of Chaos DLC? Uh... Corn? Uh, yeah, probably corn. Gotta wake and wait, make our way up the coast. I've got to get to Ulth one. <laughs> I've been saying this for fucking hours. I've got, just gotta go on with it. Chief Warlock, Icket Claw. <laughs> I don't really want to go in that direction. We we'll go around here. We're gonna lose a little bit of ground here. But Ikaclaw will get it back. Scamper, scamper. That she has got extra defenses and extra public order, so it should be able to hold on to itself. Especially considering uh, Rapace is only recruiting peasants, essentially. I think that is all I can do this turn. Ready Getting kill, kill. real tired. This rat is no fool. Knows who his boss is. So respected and feared would give extra weapon strength and melee attack for storm vermin. Sounds good because their melee attack is not great. Fight me, me. You die, die. Okay, let's move on. Imminent Rebellion at Carcassonne. Uh, that's okay. It should be fine. The, the garrison is beefed up as hell, so it should be able to manage that. Although, if they start coming down this way, then maybe we'll have to clear that out. Damn it. Um, which province did I just secure completely? I just secured a whole province. Which one was it? Not this one. This one. Right. Alright, moving on. I can fight you, but would rather ex- Oh, I need I need that sword of cane to come at me. I just can't leave Bretonia. It's just electric boogaloo. Round and round we go. Every time I take a settlement, armies pop out to come and take it back. I can't hold on to them. Is there a red line buff for Skaven Slaves in the first group? There actually isn't, no. Oh, 
Zeusa Harkon is heading towards mainland. Son of a bitch. feel my my throat start to get sore not not sore but tired you know what i mean like if you've been talking for a really long time like a full fucking day while screaming like a rat <laughs> my vocal cords are really tired right lou and leonco is bloody beefed up as well What time is it for me? It is 8.23 p.m. I started streaming at midnight yesterday. Anthony Lorenzen, um, almost done legend. We can see the light at the end of the tunnel. You got this. Yeah. Did I just read that out twice? Um, the thing is, though, I, I have to do a certain like objective in order to finish this off. Uh, I won't feel right unless I do it. I've got to get the Sword of Cain. Why are you not fast forward the turns? Because I need to see what's going on. There's a lot go there's so many enemies, if I don't pay attention to them, I could miss something very important. Alright. We now have Vectique with a decent army. That's good. That is good. Now, what do we want to do with him? I could... I can't quite jump over here. Vecti could really help out there, that's for sure. Big time. But that leaves this area here as some of my most undefended territory. Now, with Luther Harkon coming up this way, maybe Vecti can sort him out, but that's not who he turns. Uh, if we have a look at this... Yeah, he's just outside there. He might be going for Kofa, I'm not entirely sure. Um, I'm just going to occupy Lashiek. We've got... I'm just going to go at tier 1. Got to get rid of Ark and the Black. Got to get rid of all the things. Um, 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 um. Alright, so this one here... Channel fights clear. You approach Clan Moors. <laughs> tribute, yes, yes, tribute offering fun. Yes. Me, me. Yes, I will kill, kill you, thing. I am quick, I am mighty. This is curious. Uh, alright, 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 alright. What am I going to do with this? Sorcerer event. Probably not really looking to jump into the Empire just yet. Yeah, these things here need to be dealt with. As much as I want to take out Carcassonne. Is that their last settlement? No. No. Yeah, we've got to we've got to protect Castle Carcassonne. So, how about you come over here in ambush stance? Right, I didn't realize he was there. Okay, how about this? How about you force march to here? And we have a hundred percent success chance with that, right? Yeah. Take out Orion first. We might just have enough movement to put one of these armies in ambush dance. Cool. Minimal amount of damage. 
get some replenishment. Black hunger be gone. Would Queek be the best rat with the sword of cane? Um maybe. Alright, we can actually reach us, so can we I need to get this one here out of over there. Not like Yeah, he can still reach us. Engineer, here. He definitely doesn't have lightning strike. No malice detected. Yeah, that one's really just a case of Do fingers crossed, I think. Now, you know what? We really should get him out of Fort Smudge. So, what we'll do is we'll kick him out for somebody else. Uh, I think we've got somebody that's disciplined, don't we? Gracier of Ruin here. That would boost the Storm Vermin a fair bit. All hail, Hornet Rat. Now, if he attacks, we, at least we can fall back. Of course, that other lord would have been better. Uh, this one here doesn't have a... Um, help it attendant. Cool. And I think neither does this rat here. I'm gonna send Vectique up this way. We need we need somebody unstoppable to come and help us out. So I should be able to jump over here next turn. Yeah, I should be able to jump over there. I can't do it this turn. I might start raising another army soon. I don't see any reason not. I got I got money. Finances are in much better shape. Yeah, we really need to get those uh, public order buildings up. Gotta get the Lord Recruit rank up. I think we're currently at 8, is that right? Let me just double check that. Yeah, currently at 8. We gotta get to 13. That's when good shit really happens. Looking at this. Yeah, that's good there. That's Karak Azor. Do that. That's total trash. But if that when that besieges this, I'll be able to order resolve, get rid of it. I think. Diabolic devices. Uh, I think the purpose of just occupying these is nothing more than to provide a distraction for those that come over this way. But don't keep it inside the settlement. Just in case it gets attacked, it's just, that way it won't get wiped out. Alright, any new enemies? No, nothing here. Okay, what about new heroes? Well, I don't have much money. Cunning. They'll still be there next turn. Alright, get rid of a Warlock Engineer. We do need to get more of those. Machines and sorcery. Okay. Wait, let me check the other one as well. No. But yeah, like I said, uh, we've got to push up this way, but at the same time, I, I just got to clear out this crap. 
kind of feel like I need to go into Athel Lauren and take all of this out. Because otherwise they, they just recruit so quickly. Clan Scryer. Problem is those territories are not good. It's all red. The other option is just ignore them. Let them do some damage. But I gotta get to Ulthwan. Which is also red territory. Fucking shit objective. Alright. Check in for new enemies. Nope. Alright, moving on. Have you ever done the Wolf Rat Strat versus Ethel Lauren? No, I've never done that. Um, I can see how that could work. Yeah, Wolf Rat seems like they'd be alright against um, Wood Elves. Alright, we're going to need to get an emergency army going at Sartosa. Actually, it doesn't need to be at Sartosa. Maybe start doing it with Eugenie. Got forces coming in over here as well. Well, I'm just glad somebody is fighting someone other than me, so that gives me a little bit of relief. Oh, uh, here comes Corone. So it's like, anti-player. Sort of. I mean, I did declare one of them. What's the plan for the channel 2023? Um, I have no idea. Just, just keep making videos. Just do the best I can. Uh, I'm probably not going to work too hard. Going to just mostly chill. So uh, there's nothing going on in the Total War scene at the moment. So I just kind of got to wait until something does happen. Because I just end up working too hard and burning myself out. And then when something does happen, I'm not in a good frame of mind. So I'll just wait. This guy would do well with with this. It saved me a little bit of money. That's a good event, that one. Yeah, 100. Wild hunt. Alright, well, I'm not sure where Carl Franz went. Call me me, now I am. That army is actually not that difficult to deal with. Maybe I should bring Vectic back around here. This army looks like it's heading towards Martek. It just doesn't make it. Alright, if there's a chance that if I land here, maybe I'd fight them. Yes, good. Set suit to war, fight, go. It's fine. Our underling are bigger, stronger. Science, sorcery, death. <laughs> yeah. Got to get over here and wipe them out. We take that out and we cripple Arkan. Wait, how many summons does he have left? Is it two? Cool. That means I know where they are. Here and here. And he can't really recruit anything from there. I am a lord of Bretonia. Never. Grace. Fire says, says, yes. You will fight. You 
That's a decent result there. So get the two Wood Elf armies I was worried about. This should be an easier to resolve. Recruit a new army in Araby now that you need to hold Gelsa's Vectique in the vaults? Yeah, maybe. This army here has proven to be fairly effective against um, Empire as long as we're actually ambushing. So. Why don't we do this? Why don't we do this? Regular stance to here. See if we can lure them down here to attack us. Alright, I think Vectique needs to deal with Luther Harkon. He's coming in hot. You know, taking him out, kind of really inconvenient, but it's just, it's just gotta get done. What's up? Yeah, thanks. Of all Total Warhammer factions, which one would have the best dash down cavalry in your opinion? Uh, probably Reich, uh, the Empire, because they're Germany. I don't know. <laughs> just a weird, weird question. Alright, we just finished that technology, which, that's good. Enormous caches would give us more ammunition. And reduce upkeep costs. Play Gabby needs to be built. Um, yeah, right, do that one. The vermin tide. Nice to say, move. Needs to stay here. Knows who his boss is. All right, yep. Save me money, which means I can get more troops. And I need to get rid of this rebellion. Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Bring in this other army, because the more experience it gets, the better. Oh, it won't make it. Yeah, it won't make it. Oh, he's drinking? Uh, it's, it's kind of like G Fuel, kind of. Or is it, no, hang on, I think it's an iced tea. <laughs> I'm not actually sure what it is. I think it's an iced tea that my wife made. Actually, I'm not sure what it is. Vodka, I hope. No, you don't drink alcohol during a 24 hour stream. That's a good way to put you to sleep. Warlock of Skaven Blight. Absolutely right. not. Good, good, good. Now, now. Yeah, we'll just have to wait and see what happens there. At least we took out those forces. Um, see, so we got this one coming in hot. Yeah, it's just whack a mole. Whack a mole, I can barely expand. <laughs> it's just. Now, now. <laughs> well, you know, we are making expansion, but, you know, for every two settlements that we gain, we lose one.
Uh, Storm Vermin Decent now, you just gotta not use them for the fun of it. No, it was a, like, a reward for the chat. Um, for you guys donating to Extra Life. I would, I would not normally recruit this. Alright, I think I do need to recruit another army. Like, we're, we're making decent coin, but I can't expand because of the sheer number of armies that I have to deal with. We could probably get away with recruiting a fairly basic army out here, because they're just throwing soul. so much trash at us. So, over here, let's have a look. Since they're recruiting peasants, you know what I'm going to recruit? I'm going to recruit a doggo army, because I think it's going to do really well against them. Get a warlock master that's cunning. But yeah, the doggos are cheap. Yes, yes. And uh, if it gets wiped out, well, I just don't care. Yeah, we're not going up against armored opponents, so let's get Wolf Rat's Poison down here. So, yeah, we'll see how that goes. Warlock, master of going Sky. full intensity over here. Alright, let's have a look what heroes are available. Uh... No. No. There's a pack master, isn't there? Plague Priest. Alright, so the Pack Master. Where's the closest place I could recruit it and it be of some value? I could throw it into Vectik's army, because he's already got one. And he's got too many rattling guns anyway. Alright, let's do that. Alright, I still got some money to spend. Uh, Brion is probably going to come under attack. Uh, we saw... Um, uh, just, just leave it. We'll see what happens. Um, Virus is... Just, just leave it. Upgrade Kofa. Upgrade Al Haik. That should be safe. Upgrade that. Uh, maybe actually make some more money from here. That'd be good. And any new enemies? Nope. All right, all right, all right, all right. So, 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 so. Doom decay. Yeah, I saw uh, Corone come down this way, so I think they're going to attack Brion. So let's cancel that. We'll see how that goes. Good supplies of food, so losing it's not that big of a deal. I also see there's something coming down to Karak Lifter, but I can't do much about it. Um, Karak Izor, let's get that. That'll give us more food. And let's just save up that money. Okay, let's move on. Why don't you start an undercity in Lothan to start getting line of sight over there? 
Yes, I'm gonna do that. That's a good idea. Yes. I'll get a engineer over there. We'll get some. We'll get an undercity. I gotta. I gotta keep an eye on it. Uh, let's have a look at how the uh, donations are going. Yes. Oh, it was actually Grom that took it. Good thing I cancelled that. Um, if we're lucky, he'll occupy it. If not, he'll blow it up. Yeah, he just sacked it, whatever. Alright, we're at 13,362 for extra life for uh, Johns Hopkins. For the Dash Hounds, we are at 5385. Good effort, guys. And for the Fawcett Society, we are at 3,318. Good effort, guys. Really good effort. Alright, Box of Eerie Noises is... I don't think that's very useful. No, we've already got good research for it. I'd say... Get the money. More money means more troops. Sword of Cain claimed. It's over here now. I just have to find a way to declare war on Slanesh. Alright. If I get an engineer from here. And set him set sail over there. We can go and do that stuff. Magic missile. Progress. Yes. Oof. That's... Hide away. My servant fails me. Oh, look at that bit. Machines see. And, and hmm, that's interesting. Back into tunnels! I must keep my holy vow. No! It's, it's mostly just peasants, but it says that we'll lose. Now! Now! I can't ambush that one, and I can't get to there. The rate of attrition at the moment is not that bad. Not that bad. Waiting another turn. Wait, these wolf rats can do a hell of a lot of damage to peasant bowmen. Hell of a lot. I refuse. Wow, wasn't expecting to do that much. Globally recruit them? No. Uh, hmm. Okay. I'll uh, recruit another lord here and just transfer it over. Oh, cunning. Luther Harkon is about to arrive oh, here do. with quite a lot of troops. Okay, Vectik. He can force march to Sartosa. This smells fishy. 
I think the chances are that Luther Harkon will just besiege it. So what we'll do is we'll actually mo move over here in ambush dance. I'll move to here, get rid of one of these rattling guns, transfer this into here. And even if he besieges the settlement, there's actually a chance we could ambush him because our ambush success chance should be something like 140%. So, if he swings around here, I'll get him. If he lands here, I'll get him. Huh. I think we should just sack it, because I know that um, Grom is around. What you ask is impossible. Let the bell scream, scream. Attack, die for the horned rat. Technoc sorcerer. Stamper, scurry. I'm at maximum food. Um, I didn't really take that much damage. I'd say occupy. But isn't it impossible to ambush an army while it's sieging a city? No, it's not impossible. This is very difficult because you have to have more than 100% ambush success chance. Going to ambush dance there. Grum comes over here to pick up my poor Storm Vermin. Well, we'll show him who's boss. Alright, I need to get respected and feared so that uh, you can be better as a uh, Storm Vermin commander. Try to defend it up. Let's see how we go. Alright, what are we doing now? Uh, this one over here... Master Engineer! Yeah, you can see Findle's coming around over here to attack Karak Muftar. And it looks like he'll arrive there next turn. And with 16 units versus 15 units, we won't win. Our units are nowhere near as good as that. Um, can I get another nuke? I feel like I can. The no, doom next wheels time. come. Warp, lightning. All right, you just go into ambush dance over here and Close just him. see if anyone comes down this way. If anyone does, go and kill them. Gracie. Losing Carrie Buffdale is not the end of the world. Just uh. To go reclaim it again. When Bektik's finished with that, maybe. Alright, let's check heroes and see what we've got. Discipline Chieftain. I will actually accept that. I'm going to put that here. Let the bell scream, scream. Stick it in that army. Okay. 
That's fine. And yeah, if we can get that sort of cane to like come at us down this way. So close, but also so far. How much do we need to do for victory? Oh, I gotta destroy Carcassonne, right. Alright, still got some money. What should we build? Kofu looks okay. I don't have time to recruit anything there. Hang on, if I'm recruiting lords at rank 9, I might be able to do something with this. I'll get this dude, put him in here, I might actually be able to do something. And Chaos Plague. That could be the difference between victory and defeat. Do I have any regiments of renown available? I do. Um, uh, get these two, because um, missile units not going to be very helpful. Okay, we might actually be able to repel them. Okay, I shouldn't spend any more. Ah, oh, shit. Um, command available where? Brion? Yeah. Chosen. Okay, let's move on. Why are you saving always the heroes? Well, so the next time I play Skaven, I don't have to go through all this recruiting and disbanding. I can just recruit them. From previous campaigns. Sorry, Tretch. Unless you're ready to confederate. Which you're not. No deal. Well, hot diggity damn. We probably haven't saved the city, but at least you're dead. Die for Hornet Rat. <coughs> it bought us one turn. Better than nothing. We took out a Talson army. <laughs> They're like, two armies aren't enough. Let's bring that three. Did they nerf the C encounter power powers? Always 12 week units for 8k gold now? Oh, I feel like it's about the same as it was in Warhammer 2. So the garrison here is, yeah, there, there's no stopping that. And Luther, oh, you son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. This is what I'm talking about, about like AI that's just really frustrating to fight. Oh, for fuck's sake. Well, I gotta go deal with Reichland now. Ready to march. <laughs> Alright, well here's some good news. Engineer of Scryer. Alright, ambush success chance is 
Which means I can't ambush them. Science and sorcery. There. However, if I if I can manage to defeat this guy within two minutes, we'll knock him out of that stance. You're gonna need a health potion. Alright, it get let's do this. Cause yeah, I gotta get rid of Ark and he's pissing me off. Alright. They've been coming in really quick. Um, we just need to rush up there and like immediately kill this dude with our Gisales. If we if we snipe him really quickly, then the battle will just end. And Arkham the Black will be pushed out of his current stance. Of course, if I don't succeed, then I've got a hell of a fight on my hand. Hell of a fight. I really wish I had, um... Okay. Luckily, we're already within range. Just... I'm gonna need accuracy on them. You guys move up. No, 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 don't dodge, don't dodge, shoot him. Oh my guys, you need to move. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> the 20 second battle. <laughs> I didn't use the heal potion. <laughs> Pushed Arkin out of the way. <laughs> so we still get a bit of a fight in our hands here, but that makes it significantly easier. Chief Warlock, Icket Claw. I forbid this. Okay, now here's the thing. It would be ideal for us to win the battle without having killed 500 of them. But I don't think there's any way I'm going to be able to do that. There's no way I'm going to be able to sneak in there. Oh well, we just, we just got to get on with it. So that means... That means we need to set up in such a way that when the Ushabti drop, we can like immediately wipe it out before it gets a chance to um, to kill us. Because unfortunately, Ushabti are very good against every single one of my non-hero units. 
Getting 400 kills, sorry, 500 kills is not going to be a problem. Um, Plague will rip him to shreds. We've essentially got unlimited winds of magic. Well, pfft. yeah, no, we've essentially got unlimited because of uh, Ica Claw's unlimited power. Because it only does like one damage to him when he miscasts. Alright, so the way we got to do this is by spreading our units out like this. Like this. Right? And then having a unit of rattling guns basically aiming at the unit. So that if the, the thing shows up, we deal with it. Then you also need units aiming at the rattling guns. <laughs> And then you need other units aiming at other units. Basically, everybody's aiming at everybody. Being like, are you going to get hit by those things? And you, if they drop it down, you need to pop down the, uh, the things. You're going up first. Right. You gotta get those kills real quick. Alright, need this and this. Give me some wins. Healing potion? Yeah. All right, Ica Claw, I want you to start bashing down the gate here. So that provides about five wins of magic every time he does that. Oh, I think that miscast actually did a fair bit of damage to him that time. Just not sure if I've hit the um, the required amount. Yeah, just not sure. Yeah, you're right. I should take the mortars off fire at will as well. That would be very bad if they start shooting around over here. <laughs> Everybody's fucking aiming everyone. He's gonna keep an eye on it. Who's going to be the dude that gets hit by the Ushabti? Yeah, it's coming. It's coming. They should have taken 500 casualties now. I know we don't have 500 kills, but they crumble. There it is. There it is. There it is. Ready, ready. Heist and hurry. That's how it's done. Not a single casualty. Apart from summons. Did it. 
All right. Then they get the one. Haste to be prepared. All right, so no, don't do that. Let's get ready to start bombing. So I think Ikaclaw needs to use um, unlimited power twice, does about 100 damage, in order for that dude to get one cast. I wonder if Scorch might actually be better. Uh, he'll just heal what he's already done to himself. They just carpet bomb everything so they take damage over time. Three hours left, so I'm still no freak. I've, I haven't budged against uh, the sort of cane in hours. We've got him to start making a big push. Like I said, when we're down to like one hour left, I'm just gonna fucking bang it over there. See what I can do. Do they have any artillery that I could? Oh, is this? Uh, what's the Kikula doing in melee? That's not ideal.
Right, I'm gonna get a Giselle unit over here. I'm gonna see if I can snipe this dude. I've only got enough room in there to use one. It's probably not gonna work, but if I can snipe him, great. If not, not the end of the world. Doing a decent job of dodging. Gotta give him that. I feel like they're trying to waste my ammunition with the hex race, sir. Oh, they can shoot from that distance, but he's a tricky boy. Freaking guard mode. Okay. We're gonna have to start making some kind of push. Uh, let's see how much flimsing uh, Ruin does on these guys. Okay, it's okay. Uh, Sopish did a 35 Zar um, super sticker. Appreciate that, dude. Thank you. Critical hit. Uh, Nakai and Wolfheart's campaign any better after the change of Warhammer 3? Yes, they are better. Yeah, both of them are much better. Especially Nakai. Nakai's campaign is essentially fixed. Yeah, I played a Nakai campaign and I thought it was good. damage one volley did. Uh, Aaron Holloway did a tender little super chat saying thank you. Uh, not super chat, super sticker. Appreciate that dude. Thanks for the support. Guys, I'd prefer it if you didn't do the super stickers though and just, um, if you're gonna donate, donate to one of the charities. That's what I prefer. But you know, you, you do whatever you feel comfortable with. A bit of fan of MOBAs? Not oh, really. Really. 
It's doing decent damage to this Sabokal Stalkers, that's for sure. Yeah, we gotta be careful. There's quite a few fast units. Fast and, well, fast ish and powerful units. Gonna get a unit of rattling guns over here and just see if we can shoot through this way. Um, let's get a menace below on top of that. Oh, I didn't summon in the right spot. Yeah, there we go. Shoot through that. Good. Try this again. Hopefully, this time it actually works. There we go. Oh, man, I just want to inflict the army losses and be done here. Oh, shit. Okay, almost took a casualty there. So we're gonna take casualty. Yep, we did. And there we go, there's the army losses. One casualty, it seems. Couldn't couldn't get it quite perfect. <laughs> right at the end, one casualty. Yeah, just one. Oh well, it's fine. Whew. Oh man, three hours. How am I gonna fucking get that sort of cane? just can't get there. Every time I'm trying to make a push, it just something gets in my way. There's just so much force between myself and the Sword of Cain. And the Sword of Cain's not coming for me. How do you know how many losses I need for army losses victory? You just get a feel for it after a while, but it's not about how many casualties, it's about the relative damage that you've done compared to what they've done. No, should we find a sacker? And occupy it. I could get an Arkan. Attack that later. Because otherwise, Arkan's gonna. 
my technocracy. If I take him out, he's not going to be able to run off anywhere. I'll just have to kill that later. They're just not going to get a chance to recover. There's, there's no way they're going to do anything about it. But I just... The only way... I can take this is if I tag out Ikiklaw right now, which I don't want to do. Just take it next turn. It's for, oh, but then I've... Oh, don't worry about it. Don't, worry about it. It's, I don't want to waste the food, but I don't have a choice. Alright, I don't think there's really anything we can possibly do here. No. Address me as <laughs> What if? No way. But what? What? This, there's no way this will work. But what if we attacked him and he he like ran off no. the battlefield, right? <laughs> Don't disappoint me. No, no, he won't do that. Surely. We've only got a 35% chance of ambushing him, so tag this guy out first. There's no there's no way this will work. There's no way, but let's let's try. Because this could save us so much time and energy. Where is it? I need someone sneaky. Preferably a Gracier. Of plague, yep. Don't disappoint me, me. Don't worry about doing plagues. Just get the ambush Reveal and see if he just. Stone. I may need to get rid of this because I'll need to be able to hide, and that thing can't hide. Yeah, it's just this is just a to see if this would even work. Could you imagine if they actually tried to leave the battlefield against this? God, imagine if it, I, I really don't think this is going to work. I really, 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 really don't think this is going to work. If we just hide our army, hide our lord, will these guys just leave the battlefield? So far, in every single ambush that we've done in this entire campaign, even when the odds are not in our favor, they've just run away. It's like it, they're hardwired to um to just run away. Yeah, you gotta hide or else Carl Franz will kick your ass. Nah. Nah. It, it was a long shot, but it doesn't look like that. Okay, I know where the Hammer of the Witches is. Yeah, there has to be a degree of, um... You have to have at least somewhat of a chance in order to do this, it seems. That'd be pretty funny. The thing is, it won't save the city. Look at that, they got off the Hammer of the Witches. For the yeah. 
Unfortunately, the uh, the steam tank there is causing problems. Yeah, it, we're just too badly outpowered. Nuke, it won't do anything. That's a, like I would do it if it would do something. Like it just kill a lot of them, but won't actually mean anything for the battle at all. It just won't mean anything. Because even if I do this and they don't move out of the way... <laughs> uh, they're still not going to leave the battlefield. I thought for a second there that they were leaving the battlefield. <laughs> they're, they're searching for him now. I thought that, that for a moment that they would actually leave the battlefield. I was like, no fucking way. I don't know what's what. <laughs> I, I just kind of felt like for a moment there that they were going to leave the battlefield. That you have to stand something of a chance. They just won't do it. Otherwise, I really thought they were walking off at one point. But yeah, they're searching and destroying. They're looking for us. It's my last one. Make it count. Oh, they almost managed to wipe that out. Alright, well, that was cool. Close defeat. Mm. I don't think he's going to gain any experience from that because he didn't actually do any damage to us whatsoever. Uh, but that was uh, interesting. That was interesting. Um. What if you hadn't triggered the combat, would their default position be to run away? No. No. Look, I'm not entirely sure what it is, but I think you have to be at least even in terms of balance of power. And if that's the case, they'll run away. But if you if they massively outpower you, they'll stand and fight. I mean, I can ambush him again. Not have my consent. Don't disappoint me, me. I definitely don't want to drop another nuke. Um, 
They're gonna come down here and occupy Karakwifta. I can't stop that. The garrison is smashed. Never. But he lost a few units. So... At the very least... Oh, hang on. I gotta be careful now. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna try something tricksy. Kill at once. There it worked. <laughs> Gave me that and then disband him. Cool, it worked. Right. He's gonna take character buff there, but I'll I'll come and reclaim it. He's not gonna be able to beat Vectique. Warlock, master of Scryer. All right. Uh, like I said, we need to be pushing towards towards Ulthwan. Machinations. Strike when I say. One day the main lead rule. Warlock of Skaven Blight. Move tail. We make that stronger. Read warp scroll. Okay, so we're sending an expedition to go and claim the sword of Cain if we can. If we can. Chief Warlock, it is clear. That that will work. Do not take me for a fool. Yeah, if I got intercepted with this, you know we won't win. However, 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 however. He's got a lot of campaign movement range. If I, with this army, stand here, Karl Franz might attack us instead of Karak Buftar. And out on the field, we would have a much better chance of winning. Enemy. Plus, I would also have Grip Bomb. So, we'll see. We'll see if he takes that bait. He might go for it, he might not. Um, but yeah, I won't get wiped out, at least. It's okay if we lose the battle. Just don't want to lose ground. Alright, over here we've got some stuff to do. Yeah, they brought more armies over. If I sally out now. Alright, I think I can still win, but I gotta bring in the other army. I think I know what I need to do. Because, like, this is all just peasants. And a few of those guys. So, if you come over here, I can't ambush you. Okay, now. Here's what we do. <laughs> Jeez! I get to use the micro-intensive forces while my army comes in, and they can only bring in one army at a time. And then we just decimate them with our overwhelming numbers. Not to mention, these guys here should also get six menace belows. Jeez! Because all we need to do here is win the battle. If we win the battle, then we ambush them in the next subsequent fights, which means we can just get, get them to withdraw. 
It didn't work. Look, these guys didn't come in. It, yeah, it didn't work. Oh, well, shit. Well, shit, it didn't work. Well, we'll just have to figure it out now, won't we? So, where are my other reinforcements then? I'm missing some troops. Fuck, I'm just gonna go. Just fucking YOLO at them. Quick, fast. But I'm rushing the army. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna rush them. Use our superior speed against them. Pop that down right in the middle of them. Yeah, this went pretty well against the first army. We really didn't take much damage, and they've been torn to shreds. So far. If I can manage to kill him, them losing 10 leadership is going to cripple them. Okay, here's the next thing we need to do, right? Just park ourselves near their reinforcement zone so that their archers get absolutely no chance to um, come onto the battlefield. Just forget about their lords, just run straight over to here. these guys to leave the battlefield just yet. Watch, watch. Guide us on one. 
Warlock Master! Ready, ready! Ask Goddard Master! Clan Rats! Come on. Go and get over here. Fight! Fight! Scouting desk, yes! What? What? At once, Let's be before master. the archers get here. Our tile's yours! I'm just gonna get these guys here off the battlefield. Let's go, 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 go. Okay, good. Now, as they come in, they basically have no chance to do anything, especially the archers. That's what we wanted. Henry. <laughs> yeah, what's what's that from? Clan 
Oh, they are trying hard to kill my lord here. They are trying hard. the bombs yeah but I'll kill my own units with that as well we're, we're too much in a blob Problem's not um, these units, but the lords. I think they're the ones doing all the damage to us. So, seems like my reinforcements don't want to show up at all. <laughs> I've screwed myself out of this. Oh no, I've got reinforcements. Oh, okay. Oh, the garrison. Rats have all got loads of kills. Uh, they've actually got very little reinforcements remaining. Yeah, I, I think we got them. Like, they should get the ambulances real soon. He got 800 kills. Run! 
Oh look, it's blue. Back Instead of green, look. It's like I'm controlling an allied unit. Good, good. Oh, really Faster, scurry. Yeah, we army lost them, but Rapunz still needs to be taken out. Shot. I didn't end up even needing those. Yeah, all they're doing is tickling him. Never mind. All right, they've taken massive casualties, so that's good. Not using those two bombs physically hurt me. I I would have, but they would have done more damage to me than to them. Our units were better than theirs. I believe Rapaz was on Force March, so she's wiped out. I must keep my holy vow. Henry no. got wiped out too. Engineer Warlock That that will work. <laughs> Machines and that sorcery. Yeah, don't give these a chance to recover. Warp stones. Overrun them. Channel fight clear. Okay, then let's give him a thing, a thing thing, one of these things, see you later. Good, and you, you've already got one. Machines and, and sorcery. Hmm. 
I will not blight my soul. Warlock master. Uh. Sky says yes. Says. Yeah. What tribute do you offer the great king? Yeah. Probably shouldn't have pushed so far out here, actually. Master engineer. Oh, God, I just don't want to fight them anymore. <laughs> I've, got to get, uh, I've got to get north. All right. Well, are we finally done with the turn? I think so. Any new enemies? Yes, we have the Rakap Dynasty. That we should make amends. Okay. Should we better take Xandria to finally stop Reparts and wipe her off the map? It's not her only settlement, she's actually got quite a few. Yeah, Carrick Blifter's gone. No way we can save that. Let's do our best, try and get that developed. If we can't get it developed, don't worry about it. 1.21 gigawops! <laughs> Well, I've actually got a lot of money left over. Alright, that's fine. Let's just get moving. Got a lot of levels up, but I don't think it even matters, and I'm really getting fatigued. As he says, I'm going to bed again, second time during the stream. Congrats on that win. Alright, no worries, dude. Um, Good night. <laughs> How are you enjoying Total War Uka Claw campaign? Yeah, I like playing Uka Claw. It's good. It's good. Oh, it's time this. I hate no fires. <laughs> Give me one. He's got to send me that skin. Yeah, I kind of figured something like that was going to happen. Doing alright, Legend? Yeah, I'm just tired. Just tired. Uh, we're at hour 20... 22 or something. It's, it's just, uh... Battery's low. That's all. Oh, they just end up sacking it? Or are they going to sack and occupy it? Wow. Wow. What a fuckhead. <laughs> what what a fuckhead. So, Emperor, you know, of all the internal issues that we have with Chaos Warriors at our back door, what should we do? Let us venture to the southern mountains and sack a rat hole. Who is with me? Aye, sir. Fucking idiot. <laughs> like something out of the Holy Grail. I shall bring a tank to destroy these rats. Fucking asshole. <laughs> oh my god. They don't... How many fucking armies do I have to kill? They just don't stop coming out of the goddamn ground. 
Oh, I see what they're doing there. Yeah, I figured they were going to throw a lot of force at us there. I can't run away this time. Decisive defeat. What's up? Oh, thanks. That's good dinner. Hmm? No, I'm good. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm fucked. Um, yeah, there's no way we can win this. But I can really badly hurt them. I don't know how I'm going to get to Ulthwan, guys. Every time I'm going off to Ulthwan, fucking Wood Elves are like, Hey, look, I've got three armies. Fuck off. Alright, you got a, you got a minute and 47 to dish out as much damage before we're fucked. Change your plans. Change your plans. This is isolated. Oh, he's on stalk, yeah. It's alright, it's two turns worth of recruiting of, you know, garbage wolves. Let's replace more. It's just like trash versus trash. Who's, who can throw the most trash at each other? It's just like. Just ignore him. I can't. I can't possibly have to hurt him. These aren't the armor-piercing ones. These are the poison ones. They're only going to be good against the peasants.
Sorry, I'm not really talking much. I'm obviously pretty friggin' tired. Need to throw a really damaged wolf rat, that's at least half damaged, into this so I can warp bomb it.
Alright, I think we're just about finished here. My units just don't have enough leadership to do anything. Try and run down the broken units as much as we possibly can. I got nothing left. Hanging on by a thread at the moment. We have smashed them though. Absolutely smashed them. Yeah, there's our, there's our monsters. Oh, this is. oh, was it? Yeah, yeah, there it is. Alright, well, they're not taking my city. <laughs> they're not taking my city. They lost most of their troops. No, we didn't stand. I couldn't get to their lords anyway. But look at look at the kills I got. <laughs> yeah, they're backing off. They're like, fuck button those damn rats. They should have kept my city under siege though, because um I I've got a damaged garrison that'll just replenish now. Seriously, fuck off. The Wood Elves are like crazy. Right in front of my troops there.
This is actually my favorite food. Oh boy. What am I eating into it? Sweet potato. Oh, so good. Yeah. Certainly not. Master Weird that they put themselves in force march right there. I guess they didn't feel like that army was a threat, but they don't see my storm vermin army. Oh my god. These wood elves, they recruit so bloody quick. Where the f fudge biscuit butthole did um, Luther Harkon go? He just. Oh, there he is. Should just be able to order this now. How many hours are left in 24 hours? Two. Red hour 23 now. More Wobstone! <laughs> So yeah, I did that to let the rebellion happen next, like over this end turn here. Oh my god! Do you take me for a chum? My servant fails me. <laughs> All I need is someone sneaky. Just anyone will do. Just be sneaky. You'll do. You'll do better. Ah, oh, piss! I shouldn't have put myself inside the city. That was my mistake there. Ah, oh, 55% chance anyway. Do not betray your king! This rat is no evil. I forbid this! Alright, that's pretty heavy duty. But our garrison is... Mostly recovered. We are brave, my people. Shame about our dude there that died. Good scheme. Right. Warlock, master of Scryer. Do not take me for a fool. Magic's energies. Uh, this one, just uh, stay over here and ambush dance, and we'll just see how we go with that. All right. Well, um, take that out. Both one ish. I just can't get close. I just can't get close, guys. I've been trying for hours to break out of this deadlock out of, out of here in um in Bretonia. Unless they bring in all of my armies, I just can't deal with the Wood Elves. Every time I take out one army, too many more just sprout out of the ground. Um, like I feel like I'm killing a Talson army every second turn. Alright, looking at this one here. What you ask is impossible. Harbinger of Doom. Warlock ready. We could get to Bordeloo. This is could just push. Great, great victory. Good, good. 
Machines and that sorcery. Fuck it. Overrun them. All hail, horned rat. Legs, tails, move. Destroy. Uh, I was hoping I could just auto resolve that, but there was a lot of force. We could definitely win this manually. This that shouldn't be a problem. Um, let me just have a quick look. Let me just see if I do this. Uh, there's no getting around it. I'm, I have to fight that manually. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. This warlock hunts blood. No malice detected. All right, this Gracie, let's kick him out. Who knows who his boss is. Or. You. That's it. Yeah, no getting around it. This has to be fought manually. But we'll have access to Plague now with this guy coming in. We'll bombard them a bit. Um, it's, a, it's a massive defeat for um, Corona at least. And this is probably the vast majority of their remaining forces. Um, and this is the furthest north that we've gone so far. Obviously, I just cannot auto-resolve that without changing the battle difficulty. It has to be fought manually. There's no other way. Uh, waiting for a better opportunity, I just don't think it's going to show up. Everywhere is just super well defended. Everywhere. Items on Grace here. It's not going to make any difference. Yeah, it's not going to matter. But the only thing that might help is like a Power Stone, which will provide, what, three wins of magic? I don't think the margins are going to be that bad. Okay, so something to keep in mind. They got a reinforcing army coming from here. If it's only it's only like four hundred troops, but if I park my forces here, um, I could shred them as they're coming in. Right, um, and the reinforcements. So I just my reinforcements. I just bring them over this way as well. So they'll come in within a minute forty. And what we'll do is destroy destroy both of these towers before that happens. It's not a huge amount of force, but yeah, these guys here will just absolutely shred them. You guys stay back. You're going to get in everyone's way. And my reinforcements will come in from the same location in six minutes. Whatever. Play claw catapult. What what hold us? Play claw catapult. Nash kill a king. There now. Come, beast pets. That obeys me, yes. Me, Gogo. Seek fine glory. Is the Dash Round charity worldwide or only in Australia? Uh, it's like local. It's it's fairly small. It's, it's, our, it's like a, a local charity. It's one that I, we personally work with, so we know that they do good things. Um, like, we, we're actually involved with the charity. We, um... 
We forced the... Uh, we forced the dash hands. They just ran straight into the town square there. Inside. So I come from Turkey to Australia, do I get to meet you? No? <laughs> right, like if you if you happen to see me walking down the street, feel free to say hi, but No, I'm not gonna organize like personal meetup one on ones, no. Alright, still waiting on my storm vermin to show up. Our tail's yours. Magic's ready. Clan chieftain. Yeah, I need I need to play priest to get here. Two minutes away. This isn't the greatest place to be because of all of the uh, the towers that can actually shoot us from quite a long distance. But yeah, look what we did to them. And you know the artillery is doing a good job here. But it's a long way, so I thought you could say yes. Look, if you're gonna come to Australia, come to Australia because you want to. Don't don't come to visit me. Like I, like I said, if you happen to come to Brisbane and you see me walking around the street, by all means, come up and say hi. But like, I'm not gonna organize a one-on-one -on -one with each individual like fan. It's just, it's, it's just, it's not feasible. What, what? Click it, yes. I appreciate that you want to, but I, I just can't do that.
But yeah, no, I hope nobody would e would ever like just come to Australia only to meet me. Like, what a waste of time. But I got nothing to offer. How many charities ask you for live stream fundraising? Uh, okay, so any any charity that asks me for support usually offers to pay, so they have like sales staff. Well, I don't like doing those ones. So usually what we do is we make connections with charities and build long-term friendships with them. So Extra Life, for example, we've been with them for two years. Um, you know, they know us, we know them. We know that they do good work. We've, we've built a rapport. They don't pay us. We don't want to get paid. It, this is this is our charity work as well. Um, ready, ready. With Devoted to Dash Hounds as well. We've, we've been involved with them six months? Quite a while. Six, about six months. Um, yes, yes. We know what they do. We know what's involved. Yeah. So we, we try to have like an intimate understanding of what the charity is about before we'll you know, do a live stream about them. Um, typically. Typically. Not always. Do I sell bath water? Um, I can sell you my toilet water if you want. Just like a chocolate milkshake, only crunchy. <laughs> what? What? Quick, quick! <laughs> Imagine that using the cocoa pops for himself. What about Fawcett? Do you know them for a long time too? No, this is a very new connection. Very new connection. So we'll see how things go with that. Um, it's it's very new. Literally, literally like a week or two of like chatting with them. That's about it. It's so, it's actually, it's so new that I'm concerned about, like, talking about them because I might get it, like, it wrong. Because <laughs> it's very, very sensitive stuff. And I'm a little bit out of my depth with that kind of stuff because I'm just a, I'm just a, I'm just a poor computer boy. You know, I, the woes of women I just... Ugh. I don't know, basically. I just don't know. I don't know what they go through. Why is there no little merchandise anyway? Uh, because they don't... I don't sell snake oil. Oh crap. If you guys want a t-shirt and put Legend of Total War on it, just go and do it. I don't care. Um, like, I don't want to sell you guys a $70 t-shirt that says see you next time fuckers or something stupid on it. Just, uh, I just don't want to do it. Check out merch, link in bio. Buy a billion dollars worth and get a free sticker. Have you got your mum's credit card? Good, now buy $500 worth of garbage. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just not big into merch. Like, I get that some people like merch and everything, but I just, I just can't be fucked. That's all it really comes down to, I just, I just can't be stuffed. I'd probably make a lot of money, but you can't live your life 
thinking every little thing about making money. There, something's got to give. Something's going to be like, yeah, I could probably make a lot of money, but I can't be fucked. You know, I'd only do it if I was absolutely desperate. Play claw catapult. What? What? Do you know what's funny? When these guys here are out of ammo and I'm out of magic, do you know what I'm doing? Sending in the storm vermin. I think switching this one to plague was a good choice. This is such a powerful roll of magic. How are things after stopping the streams? It's a lot quieter. It gives, gives me a lot more time to you know, actually do things. Um, yeah, it's good to take a break. Like. There, there is a chance that later down the track that I'll go back to doing full-time live streaming. There is a chance, but there's also a chance that it won't. Um, I, this isn't going to be the last ever Legend of Total War live stream, right? I, I like live streaming, and in moderation, it's good. The problem that I had was that um, I wasn't doing it in moderation. I was doing it excessively, and I wasn't getting out of it what I wanted, so that's why I stopped. Uh, Tyson Bodick did become a member for 28 months, give it good work. Alright, thanks dude. It's also important to note, some people said, have said that the reason that I stopped streaming was because chat was toxic or whatever. It's not true. If you're gonna blame anything, and you can quote me on this right now, Warhammer 3 is the reason I stopped live streaming. I like Warhammer 3, but making content for Warhammer 3 has been one of the biggest challenges of my career and one of the most painful experiences ever. It's just a difficult game to make content for, really is. What's that, lightning? Uh, there was a celestial wizard. Uh, they popped down Iran and Slenderbolt. That doesn't mean that I don't like Worm 3 as a game. But in terms of a business project, it's been a fucking nightmare. I mean, compared to Warhammer 2 or General, compared to every, any Total War game. Um, Akagi Senpai became member for 27 months. Ah, right, thanks dude, appreciate the uh, support there. CA kind of stripped cheesing, which was fun. No, they didn't strip cheesing, they just changed the cheese. Cheese is still there. Loads of cheese in Warhammer 3. Loads of it. Um, it's just different, that's all. I haven't played Warhammer yet, so don't buy it. Mm. You gotta make your own mind up about it. I'm not gonna. I'm, I'm neither going to recommend nor not recommend Warhammer 3. The only thing I would say is that you have to make up your own mind because, as I said earlier, 
Warhammer 3 split the fan base. You may like it. You also might not like it. It's not a guarantee. Um, I can't make that decision for you. So look at the gameplay. If it's something that you want, then get it. And you, you'll probably like it. Oh, God, smash it Our tail's yours. You guys here. But one thing that with Total War Warhammer is that you really can't listen to outside sources that say you should get this game. No, don't listen to anything like that. You have to listen to yourself. It's the only person you can trust. Which includes me. I can't. I can't do that. Can't do it for you. One thing that I would recommend is not playing Realm of Chaos. I think, in terms of lore of averages, if I said you'll hate um, Realm of Chaos, 70% probably will. Something like that. It's, it's a terrible campaign. Yeah, something's going on with this map. I can't summon anything. Right, here we go. Lou and Leonko taking on all of my bloody rats here like it's nothing. These guys here just can't get a good shot in. Let's get that one out of there. We've almost got him. Get out of the way. Let the let the rattling gun shoot. He's got the shields of Coron on, but that's only going to last a few seconds. Got him. Nope, that wasn't the army losses. Okay. Then leap! 
Storm vermin, storm in the breach. Shouldn't be that much longer. We've wiped out most of their bounce power. What's left? Like Lou and Liam goes down. They'll still got most of the mushrooms. Finally, god damn, that was a fight. <sighs> but that's a big defeat for um, Protonia here. Really big defeat. Oh, they've got the Green Knight. Something bugged out on this particular map. Okay, he's got magical weapons. But the Green Knight also has magical weapons, and yeah, if I'm not careful, he'll kill him. Gotta be careful.
Come on. One more hit. There we go. Ooh. That is a big blow to Returnia. Yeah, guys. Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get the Sword of Cain. I just don't know. I mean, I'm really trying to get there. So many obstacles in my way. What's the good stack to village? Can't you to figure what one out as you can live six gifted units. Um, Chaos spawn. Spawn of Zinch, that, okay, that's what you go with him. New warp fraud is here. Oh, oh, okay. I wasn't expecting them to be here. Oh, Bellicor's here as well. Fuck. Or at least we've met them. No, I haven't. No, I haven't. I haven't met them yet. For the 13. Uh, yes, yes. Master Engineer! Okay, we gotta be careful in this sort of situation. If we leave one army inside the settlement and one army out, what they could do is besiege with one army and then attack with the other. So, you keep both armies out of the settlement. Typically speaking. Alright, what else do we need to do this turn? Because, yeah, I just really want to get that sort of cane. Because I don't want to go over eight hours. Because I, I said I would get it. I said I would do, I said I would do it. Man, I'm a rat of my word. Okay, that is all my military moves made. Let's have a look at heroes, see what's available. I think at this point here... Probably don't need to worry too much about this. Alright, looking at construction, we have... Yep, upgrade that. Right, I also need to recruit some more forces to deal with this, um... Just recruit some more, um, wolf rats. Okay, I'm going to go with the armor-piercing magical attacks, because we've also got to deal with, um, Cetra now. So I'm going to need that armor Well, Camry, I mean. that's particularly useful apart from control but we can just get our control from here that's actually really good money There's also Luther Harkon hanging around this area like a bad smell. Why do you test her? What? One, one, come on. 
Alright, let's just get through this turn here before I worry about anything else. Um, yep, I could use that. Oh no! I think I just made a mistake. No, it's all good. That's all good. I just, because I'm trying to cause a revolt there, because we're going to keep moving. So, Arkham the Black only has this one settlement left, then he is defeated. Alright, what new enemies do we have? Okay, we're getting very close to new people to declare war on, but at least this area here is starting to get very secure. So that's good, it's just extra resources. How long do we have left? Um, an hour and 15 minutes. Alright, and... Yep, that's all fine, don't you do any of that. I kind of feel like Vectic and Ava should um, come over to King's Glade and just blow up Athelorn. So fucking sick of this place. Okay, let's move on. Ica Claw doesn't really need doubles up at this point, just, just don't worry about it. Just... Imminent Rebellion, yep, we're aware of that, and let's just move on. Oh, uh, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I just, I have, to, I just discovered them, which means I have to declare war on them. That's good though, because now they might send their army over this way. Hello, what mount is better for melee fighter, Dark Steed, Cauldron, or Manticon? Sorry for repeat. Um, it, it depends. I'd probably say Manticore is the most versatile out of those. The Cauldron's not good. Do you still hate Greenskins? I've never hated Greenskins. They're just not my one of my favorites. Just because something's not one of my favorites doesn't mean I hate them. I don't hate any race you know, in this game or in real life. Well, except for maybe Dark Elves. I don't like Dark Elves in Warhammer 3. Probably my least favorite race to play. Alright. Alright, get that and bring it over here, bitch. Bring it to me, me. So, we're trying to get to Leoness, because from Leoness it's easy to get to Misna. So I can't jump there. And then from there, we got to push our way. If I can get to Leoness, I'll raise a third army. I'll just look at wherever I can from there. Shit, I may have had other people to declare war on. Let me just double check. Now we're good. Yeah, if he's going to start bringing in his armies over here, that's good. But we need him to bring the Sword of Cain army over here. You can see where it is. Nurgle is fantastic, but slow. Nurgle is probably the weakest race in the entire game. He globally recruited a whole bunch of archers. <laughs> he knew he was dead, so he decided to blow up the settlement just to spite me. The funny thing is, is that actually benefits me because I just push it straight up to tier 3. <laughs> Man, that is like the pure definition of like dick move. Dick move, Carl Franz. It's like, if I can't have it, you can't have it. Because he's he knows he's dead. Uh, yeah, let's have a look at the donation, see how things are going. So, with 
the uh, Johns Hopkins were at 13,500. Big effort. Uh, with the Dash Hounds, we're at 5,444. Really awesome. And with the Fawcett Society, we're at... 3,475. Roughly totaling around 22... 21, 22,000, which... That's a big effort. Yeah, forget the siege. I think that we as Chaos God, we as Chaos God, Slanesh. Maybe in terms of the Chaos God, in terms of the game itself, Slanesh is actually a very powerful faction, if you know what you're doing. Whereas Nurgle, I just don't see it. Um, Miklos, Powell, Martin, Molnar, became a member for 17 months. What? No video today? Unsub, JK, have a wonderful New Year legend. Okay, this is a bit chat, dude. Uh, uh, membership. What? God damn it. Most masterful of map. <laughs> Panic flee. Master engineer. Could have done that and recruited another one. Whoops. Can we lift the siege? Can we lift the siege? No. Retreat run! Alright, one hour remains. A little bit over one hour. Oh, that's so annoying. If you close, gonna stay here for another goddamn turn. Okay. Good. There. Well, that's dead meat. I must keep my holy vow. No. Dark are these depths. Children of the Great Hall. Warlock, master of Scryer. Destroy them. All. All. Will work. Tell them to do that. That's wrong. Attack. Die for Honey Rat. Damn it, that was a lot of damage. Sacrifice to Honey Rat. Blind. Damn it, they built defenses there. Alright, going to ambush dance. Um, no, actually, actually, force march down to here. And just wait this out. Anything that we do here this is gonna way, way. Is, is just not gonna end well for uh, for this city. Drums too good for that. Master engineer. God damn. Okay. The, the council's yeah, he's out of here now. Run, scurry, and hide, hide, weaklings. Master Engineer! Wipe out! See you later, friends. You're out of here. <coughs> Excuse me. 
So that got rid of Carl Franz. For the uh, yes, yes. <laughs> me, me. All right, good idea, good idea. Um, what if? No evil doer. No. Okay, Bretonia has like no armies left, so we need to really press the attack. Um, I could go and capture Aquitaine, with this army. Well, this one here recovers a little bit. I need to put in a something for um, replenishment, like an alchemist. Week. Any new enemies? No. Alright. See the sort of cane there. So close, but so far away. Magic missile. Ah, clan Eshin. Clan Eshin assassin in. Lextails, move. Okay, so far so good. Alright, what else do we need to do this turn? Got to really friggin' leg it now. Okay, Ikka Claw's got to stay there for another turn. Right, this over here. Let me just hire like a regiment of renown at a time until it gives us a win. Have you had any other big donators like on the YouTube? Yeah, there's been big donators, but um, um, not necessarily from other YouTubers. It's kind of weird that it offered me to be even able to recruit. Destroys my entire garrison. <laughs> One more regiment of renown should do the trick. My uh, Krillin died again, became him for five months. Great to see you. Happy New Year. Alright, thanks, dude. You too. Transfer all of the units into this army. Right, transfer them actually all the way back. And you can just do the. We should keep recruiting. Oh, Trip needs to actually go back to his army. Mighty master engineer, I am. All right, all right, all right, all right. All right. 
So, how are we doing? Alright, looks like we're done for the turn. Money's a little bit tight. That's okay. We'll get through it. Alright, do a little bit of construction and then let's move on. Alright, so, I think we just did... Actually, I'm not sure which one we did. Enormous cache? I can't remember. Okay, okay, okay. Murder dissenters. No, don't worry about that. No. Go over here. Armor plus five for storm vermin. Woo! That's actually crap. No. Go, go that way. Uh, CCR became a new a member for 34 months. Uh, well done, Legend. Great seeing you live again. I was going to check out Valheim, so it feels like good timing. All right, no worries, dude. I uh, hope you enjoy it. I th I've really thoroughly enjoyed playing it myself. All right. Let's move on to the next turn. Anything to do here? All right. Let's spend a little bit of money. Maybe build like one or two things. As long as it's got like a good return on investment. Like something that we need. Like that. Pretty important. Alright, that'll do. Any any more and it's just going to be a problem. Do you menace below to get tech upgrades? No. No. Their summoned units are always Make base quick, levels uh, strength. Last hour just shy of it. Yeah, but I've got such a long way to go to get to the freaking Sword of Cain. Well, yeah, sort of. Sort of. I do need to see what's going on here. Ooh, I think he just made a big mistake. Because I can ambush him now. Oh, Luther Harkon. You busted my balls here with the, that valiant defeat. I don't want to, but if I can manage to get rid of you, it'd be a big deal. Let's let's think about this. Yeah, let's do it. This doesn't take too long, but yeah, this is a good map. This is one the, the one that we beat uh, Rapants on. I got, ordered a lot of menace below so that I can take out his mortars, essentially for free. I think that's really important. Uh, that will even the odds a little bit. Then if we get a... Um, you know, powerful tower... These animated hulks are mostly defensive. Those are a bit of a problem. Okay, just everyone hang back here. Let's have a quick look at Luther Harkon. Alright, he doesn't have his spells. He doesn't have any of his spells, so that's good. No spell casting in his army. Okay, 
gutter runners. I do have a warp bomb as well. So I can use the gutter runners to sort of spy on him. Like if I put them here, they won't be able to see us and I can just sort of keep an eye on him. So yeah, these animated hulks, not very good melee attack and melee defense, there's lots of health. Right, you stay over here. I'm gonna need you. Alright, now, we need to get 1,400. I, when I got this in that previous battle, I regretted it. Uh, I think the piercing tail is the best way to go. I know it's not accurate, but against a lot of troops, it's okay. What the fuck was that? Oh, they did... Oh, Freaking army abilities. That was actually a lot of damage. Mm. That really puts us in a bad way there. We're moving in real slow. Hang on, we got this. We're moving in real slow. Try to warp bomb that over there. Ready, ready. Stab. Retreat, retreat. Oh, never work. That was just a waste. the other mortar. Yeah, I don't know about this. I don't know about this. The, his abilities are pretty strong. No, don't do that. Be a waste. And they get one. Gotta make a count. Yeah, they are moving through here. So slow. My tower over here is ready to go. Just can't reach him yet. No come. If a big enough blob shows up, maybe. Maybe. Getting within range, but they're not quite there yet. Our tail's yours. Get to the lead, guide us on one. Sirens coming in. They're pretty damn dangerous. Clan rat spears. Creek, creek, yes. Orders. Red Tails are getting some hits in there, actually being not completely garbage. Let's see if I can actually get rid of that mortar. Come on, come on, hurry, 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 and... Oh, look at that, they turned around. I know they're going to try to go through it. 
Oh, a bit of da more damage and they'll just crumble away. Good. Mortar gone. Need to be shooting at animated hulks. Good, they're quite vulnerable to getting shot like that. Out pretty nicely. And Luther Harkon got dragged back, which is nice. Now move! They're in the infantry. And they um, regen. We need to deal dish out damage to them quickly. I know that they're fairly missile resistant, but we've got to kill them quick. We are everywhere. Otherwise they just regen too quick. And they're damage dealers. I think this is actually working. I think it's actually working. Because, like, these animated hulks, they're just going down really quickly cause thanks to the, the uh, gutter runners. Night runners, whatever. Dick Wolsey. This guy here's a bit of a problem as well because he's got a little bit more missile resistance, a little bit. But yeah, it's hard to hit. I think our best bet with that dude is like just army lossing him. Yes, yes! What? What? 
Good. Good. That is bad. I know I've got a uh, warp bomb, but I just haven't had any good opportunities to use it. Oh, hang on. Yes, I do. Right here. Storm vermin. Oh, but it's a storm vermin unit. We are by. Just let it, let it fight a little bit longer. Okay, keep Luther Harkon away from us. This guy's going down, that's good. I feel like they should be going after the rotting Prometheans here. Though they've got a lot more um, armor. Guys, crumbling. That's awesome. Keep it up. Keep Luther Harkon out of here. Was crumbling. Now he's not anymore. Good. That one's crumbling. What? What orders? Not scary yet. Just a little bit more. Get this guy out of here. Good. Luther Harkon is being stupid there. They're gonna roll over a fucking capping point. them to help out here. Here, I need this tower to aim for those rotting Prometheans. They're actually the biggest problem I think here. Luther Harkon is like stuck there. That's really good. Yeah, the problem here is I need these guys here to shoot this dude, but they're struggling because he keeps closing in on them. He was crumbling at one point. That's it, that's it, that's it. He's almost gone. Got him. Nice. Turn around here. Attack charge. What? What? Council's command. All right. This seems manageable now. for that. Uh, 
Lost one of these. Make that count. <sighs> Army losses. <laughs> uh, we gotcha. Yeah, fuck. Don't think I could have done it without those extra minutes below. Now, just you wait and watch as um, he recovers every single one of his dead units. Fucking hate that this happens in this game now. Then he'll go into encamp stance, and in the next turn, he'll come back full strength. to do a little bit more damage to him. Is there anything to get his leadership down to minus 50 that will get him to disintegrate? There we go. Does the crumbling effect deal magic damage? Uh, I think so, but I'm not sure. I know it was like that in Warhammer 2, but oh, I just don't know about Warhammer 3. I just hope the whole army doesn't come back, and all that uh, important units don't come back. Like, for example, him, I hope he's dead. I hope all them are dead. I hope that's dead. I don't really care about the infantry. Oh, good. Uh, the vast majority of his forces did die. Unfortunately, Luther Harkon did come back, but he was actually the least concerning unit in that army. The only problem is he gains experience. His Morngul got killed. He won't be able to launch the attack again unless he raises a lot of dead. Hungry clan rats. Let them feast. Which, that army there should be actually be able to get him. Oh god. Guys, I just don't think I can get the Sword of Cain. Like, I got 35 minutes left. I'm just out of energy. I'm trying so hard to get, just get there. No. I'm trying to do it for bloody eight hours. I can fight you. What will escape? I'm gonna keep trying right up until the last, but the game is throwing every obstacle in my way to prevent me from being able to do it. Like, I've left myself poorly defended, because this is what the AI does. They don't go for your armies, they go for your cities. And 
And like their their army just sits there. I refuse. Um, can we just sally out against that? Jumping in the underway. No, nah, there's 15 units sitting in there. He'll he'll get killed if I do that. Oh, God damn it! Master engineer, Clan Scryer. This warlock wants blood. Hunger be gone. Yes. Sorcerer Inventor. Yes, yes. Large army sitting in there, but it would wipe out um, Carcassonne. If we did that, we would actually get short campaign victory. Address me as Sierra. I don't want to fight any more battles. Plus, if I do that, then just got another fucking army over here to deal with. What happened to Grom? He got wiped. I don't, I don't want to fight any more battles. All hail Hornet Rat, Warlock, Master of Scry. Oh, that's Master actually a fair engineer. distance away. I'm not sure if the garrison will come out and assist. I can I can check because we've got a 60% chance of ambushing. Retreat! Run! Oh, it actually worked. All right. Well, get rid of them. Overrun them. Mighty master engineer, I am. I must keep oh my God. holy vow. No. Master engineer. Alright, that gets rid of the Lisa Harkon. Chief Warlock, Ickit Claw! Test subjects! Set suit to war, fight bone! Sate the Black Hunger, Vivians! That'll be the end of Arkhan, and beginning of other bloody wars. Machinations. Man, the she's not recruit. Oh, she's only got two settlements left. She's recruiting peasants. So many of them, though. Prior says, says yes. Good idea. I might be able to get these troops back into the settlement if. Yeah. 
carry forward. War. Warlock, master of Scryer. This is Total War, became a new member. Oh, hey, dude. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for the membership. Appreciate that. Uh, if you guys haven't already, This is Total War creates This is Total War content on YouTube. So, if, you, if you've not had enough of a This is Total War campaign, go and check out his channel. And check him a sub. Oh, yeah, I'm exhausted. Um... I know I'm gonna have to fight that manually. I just don't want to. Don't disappoint me, me. No malice detected. Greatest licks favored. Never. Machines and then sorcery! It's nowhere near as dangerous as that army that we fought against Luan Leonkor. This would give a short campaign victory though. Can auto resolve it. Probably shouldn't. Well, here's what we do: we auto resolve it, Zap, kill for and then we blow it up. Bring that way, ruined. they're defeated. And I'm not stuck inside the settlement. Victory! We did it! We did it! We won the campaign! My plan schemes always best. Warlock ready! Sneaky infiltrator! Walk! Warlock engineer! Oh for fuck's sake! <laughs> Why is he here? Go away. You're in between me and the sword of garbage. <laughs> Fuck me. Uh, also, because we got the um, the recruit rank, why don't we uh, apply that here? That's actually very useful on that unit. Oh, I need to get Vectiku for here, but he's going to have to make two jumps. Maybe even three from there. I don't know if he can make it all the way to there. Listen to me, me. That, that will work. We're not going to be able to go and capture that with what we got there. I might be able to make it there next turn. I might not. He does have extra campaign movement range, so we will see. We will see. It sucked to lose Carcassonne with that much developed into it. I think selling out and fighting it manually is not really an option. That's very strong. Yeah, this is very strong. Panic flee! Isn't it faster to go through Athel Lauren? It's not safe through Athel Lauren. If I go through it, I'll probably get wrecked. It's there's so many armies in here. I just, I can't get through it. 
So yeah, it, it's a quick aim that it would, that would get killed. Yeah, there's an army sitting right here, so if I jumped there, I'd, I'd die. I'd get killed. Like, Vectig's army's strong, but Wood Elves are, are very strong as well. We've got to consider that stuff. Um, do we have any more enemies to declare war on? Right now, I'm just trying to think of the, f the fastest in terms of time, not turns, way to get to here. Alright. Let's see what else we can do. Just briefly. I feel like this needs to be upgraded. Going with. I just don't have the money. Scaven Blight's almost tier 5. Stop it. These settlements don't matter though. Not really. Alright, let's move on to the next turn. Don't about leveling up. Most levels up are trivial at this point. And, uh. How yeah. dare you? Just gotta hope that. Oh, yeah, we've also. We've also got an army coming through this way. Hard war one. Um. We'll just see how we go. Ma Wapstone! Good, he'll be able to arrive there next turn. Here we go. God, it, of all the directions of expansion, heading towards. Oh, they went for that one. I don't want to fight it. I just don't care. It's not an important sort of Of all the directions of expansion, heading towards Ulthwine has been the most difficult. Is it 24 already? We're 20 minutes away from it. Shit, right, just back off. Back, back. Hey, Hank Fire, how's it going, dude? How's the marathon coming along now? Yeah, we're getting there. Fight! Kill! Then 
Go off the low hanging fruit. Oh, wow, there's more than one army. Taste battle, good god. How are we going with the charities? 13,700. Still going up. Good job, guys. And dash rounds hasn't changed. And. The other one's up to 3,500. Yeah, guys did amazing. I'm so exhausted. Fuck, man. I just don't have anything left. Uh, badly mutated. That's a good trait. And this is for. Vermich. That's probably a good thing. Yes, yes. This should be the end of Arkan. End of arc in the black. Cool. Kill contraptions. <laughs> Community desert attrition is definitely not bad. Channel fight chaos. We got a little bit of recovery from this one. His chance to ambush is 100%, so I, I can't actually ambush him. I can ambush him, if you were Let's see how many fucking tries it takes, though. Oh, wow. What the fuck? He actually stood in fort? Touch a battle! This meat flesh will do it nicely. Engineer, here! Alright, you. Need to recover. For horned rat. For the Go back here, get a little bit of replenishment. And this one, going to ambush stance here to protect it. Sneaky infiltrator. Reveal what stone. Yeah, they're, they're going for Montanas. Alright, what you got? Uh, give it a shot. Spectique, after all. I'm not 100% sure, but I think if, if he attacks now, um, Vectique will at least reinforce. I think. I'm, I'm not 100% sure. Wait, what? 
crude attempt to salvage. There's no sort of cane there. No. My delights are too much for thee. Short sighted. Hmm. Quick, kill things. Okay, 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 okay. How strong is he? I will not obey. Your words are them. They built up. I still strength making one. No, I'm number two. Who's number one? Don't know. All right, did I meet some more people? Yeah, I definitely did. If I had my way, you would be dealt flame and hammer. Anyone else? Good, good, good. Warlock master. Rat. Elven plot armor did a ten dollar super chat saying thank you, uh, super sticker. Thanks, dude. I appreciate that. Um, guys, if you haven't checked out Elven plot armor, he's excellent Elven player on Warhammer two and three. You should check him out. He's, he's a fellow Australian as well. I am ex so exhausted. I've got t twelve minutes left, but I want that sort of cane. <laughs> You guys gave me a mission to do it. I can't friggin' find it. Oh, yeah, my hope is next to go. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Um An affront to Orion. That should be enough to just um, a couple other units. Get some more. Thanks for the content support. Oh yeah, I should also make you a moderator. Because like, I, I make everyone a moderator that's a creator. So I can actually see you in the chat. It's Gabe and Dan as well. Oh god. Where is the sword of cane? None but Slanesh may dominate me. Alright, we've any more enemies? Alright. Ava could defend the east because she were open there. Well it's just sort of Protecting the path of Lauren. Gotta be somewhere. It says it's here, but I don't see it. It's like it's sitting. Do you know what it could be? Behold, my There's a lord weapons. that has it. Many things to make that got disbanded. Dead. I think that's what's happened. So I'd have to kill Nakari. Or something. I don't know. Just gonna focus on trying to get over there. I'll figure it out when I get there. We hadn't met uh, Malagor yet. Is Clan Pestilence immune to Nurgle Plagues? I have no idea. I reject your 
see the sword. He desires. Life is his sheep. Run it. All right. I did want to go up through here, but because Bellacor is. Oh no, if I land there. I'm not going to have any replenishment when I get there either. Ugh, the Sword of Cain is like the worst thing for the Skaven to aspire towards. Oh, look. You're done fucked up. Scream, scream. <laughs> Silly Orion. Oh my god. What an idiot. small army to come and reinforce it. That should be worth a fair bit of balance of power. Brink of Art did a 10 euro um, super sticker. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. I would! This warlock wants blood. <sighs> definitely beat that quite easily. I don't know what it was. All right, what are we doing, Beck Teeth? I forbid this dance. If Vectik runs to here, he'll be able to jump down there next turn. But these guys here should be able to handle that. I think it'd be best if Vectik stays in ambush stance and waits for Durthu to come down this way. Stephen Blue. Tetnock 
Three minutes away. I yeah. All right. What else is going on? Fire says says yes. Damn it! At last. Um, Alex Marquardt did a twenty dollar. Uh, super sticker. You are amazing. Okay, thanks, dude. Appreciate that. Thanks for the support. Um, An affront to arrive. Now! Now! Army's doomed. Scamper, march! Also do this. Knows who his boss is. All right, what are we doing next? Yeah, so we got um, them coming down here. Yeah, minor settlements are so much harder to defend for Skaven since the uh, the siege update. So much more difficult for them. That that is correct. This rat is no fool. Oh, I doubt that's gonna make any difference. Grace, yeah. Selak O did a ten dollar super sticker. Thanks, dude. Appreciate the support. Uh, let's, let's get that way. Alright, I'm just gonna focus on military only for the time being. Any new enemies? Yeah, we've discovered the western provinces. The robust have encountered a, um, a caravan somewhere. I don't know where. Who cares? Brief switcheroo in order to restore this army a bit better. This guy here provides quite a bit of replenishment, and it's it hasn't replenished fully in a long time. All right, and let's move on next turn. We did it! 24 hours is done. Um, that's 24 hours stream. I'm gonna do like one or two more turns just to see if I can get the Sword of Cain. Because, like, I'm so buggered. And I, I think what's happened here is the Lord that has the Sword of Cain is currently disbanded. In order to bring him back, um, you've got to kill other Slanesh, like their other Lords, so that they pull him out of the pool. Yeah, 
we knew they were heading down there. They don't go for your um. Oh, they just stacked it. So, the summary in total: thirteen thousand seven hundred twelve dollars and eighty-three cents for um, Johns Hopkins Children's Center. Five. Hang on, let me refresh this. $5,444 for uh, Devoted to Dash Hounds. And for the Fawcett Society, $3,574. Rough, roughly twenty-one to $22,000 um, in, in total. Huge effort from you guys. You may touch me only in dreams. They only want one thing, and it's disgusting. <laughs> they want to attack your undefended settlements. Ugh, I would normally fight that manually, but the. Uh... Which kill device do you? Oh, she didn't end up dead. Master Engineer. Yeah, because they're going for low-hanging fruit. I refuse. Seek, seek, target. Barrow, barrow. I am Demon Corner. Attack the things. Battle fight. Cancel demise. Well, hunt out Warpstone. Alright, let's try something. Going to ambush dance. Because I feel like this army is going to swing around this way and we'll catch them that way. And that also means that we'll replenish while we're sitting there. Um, these guys here are trying to escape. Hell no. <laughs> uh, cowards. Cowardly AI. Alright. A uh, rattlings and shit needed over here. Let's get another warlock master. Yep, this guy will do. Master Engineer.
am a lord of Victoria. Thanks on the fires. Jaco Draco did a $50 uh, super sticker. Damn, you guys are giving me loads of super stickers. The whole point of me disabling super chats was so you couldn't do that. But, uh, yep. Yeah, appreciate that, dude. It's generous. I just want auto resolve power. Um, I think the Death Runners are okay. For that? And maybe actually get some crap in global. No. Uh, okay. They might see the cinema anyway. Yep, you guys wait there. Ten sixty nine with that icky level fifty already, let you get in rusty. Well, wow, that's actually a good point. Um you level up a little bit slower than you used to. Um, but also the, the AI doesn't fucking send their armies at you. <laughs> the way the experience Always works for the Skaven it's not as good as it dead. used to be. So etc. No can do. So what happened with that Slanesh army? Did they? Yeah, they. They didn't come. I serve no master but the Dark Prince. There it is. This guy's got it. And all we have to do is get through Bellacor. Don't disappoint me, me. These armies here are dead. What's the... Engineer, what's, the what's your trait? Cunning. 
Can we get a sneaky dude in here? That would be a lot better. Let's get trip. Fucking hell, man. 85% success chance. My death runners, it was just what was available. Yes, yes. Channel fight chaos. <laughs> oh shit, Nicky Claw's been rummaging uh, magic for a while. Alright, alright, just go into ambush dance and keep an eye out for things out here. Protect the east for now. Shouldn't you also global recruit the catapults, Atelia? Yeah, I should have done that. You're right. I should have done that. up. Still haven't discovered him. Legend living up to the name is still after 24 hours. Oh, it's within my sights. I'm at a point now where I can auto resolve most of my battles. I just gotta persevere a little bit longer and I'll get that sort of cane. destroy Xandri, and that is the end of Rapance. And then we could just... Maybe just not worry about that area so much. Reduce our resource drain there. Attack die 
Him and put the smell away. Have them then. I, uh, I am ready. Easy fight. I just don't want to have to do it. It's quite an easy fight. This would wipe him out. I'll have to fight it. But I really don't see this battle being a problem at all. But uh, I'm gonna fight it. There we go. See, once Rapunzel has got, I'm going to blow up this settlement, leave it as a ruin, keep Ikaclaw in the area, and what he'll do is he'll just patrol this back and forth. Anyone gets around here, gets rid of them. Um, and that's it. No more expansion down here. We, and then we focus our attentions on Ulthwan. We're just about to land. Oh, fuck me, man. The other guy I think is reinforcing. Yeah, I know. I know. I wanted to auto-resolve it, but it just wouldn't let me. Oh, hang on a second. Even, yes, yes. If we could manage to beat her Play, blow up, within a few seconds, I wish I had the wolves here. Within, oh, six seconds. Wait. Yeah, that's not going to happen. I nail yours. Move. Yeah, don't don't waste that money. I was going to use a nuke, but I can't decide against it.
<laughs> I'd do Skaven voice, but too tired. Whee! Let's be over. I've clearly won the battle. Fuck off. You guys are gone. Surrender. You're finished. There we go. See you later, Rapunz. That be the end of it. The worst nuke I've seen was Mercy's and like six hundred dwarves to a nuke. Oh yeah, that that is Yeah, that's probably the, the most devastating nuke I've ever seen. That that was nuts. Absolutely nuts. So that army should be completely wiped out. It's already retreated. Just raise it. Sort of. Okay. Gone. Okay. Get rid of these. This will save us a lot of money. We can redirect it elsewhere. So yeah, Echo Claw will just like patrol this general area. Patrol. This over here is. I don't think it's gonna be able to defeat us. Let the bell scream, scream. Yes, get up, buddies. Alright, we've made landfall into Ulthwan, finally. You fight, you die, die. Luke Steam, pile it up. That sword is mine. <laughs> Rolling Doom! <laughs> I wanted more nuke. Warlock, master of Scryer! Tyrion, fuck off. Alright? This doesn't concern you. Mind your own goddamn business. They see a control there now. I I am ready. Um. I order a scary move. 
way more important this one here replenishes and we're gonna force march this one into into Trilinear. slaves at ours. Red mage. For the 13. <laughs> yes, yes. Replenishment. Alright, right, alright, alright. And why don't you switch that over? Five turns. Uh, all right, let's get a Vermintide going. In order to not be detected, we have to build these first. Mm. And I'm going to need this guy over there as well, because the more heroes that are there, the more you can conceal it. Swords in sight, yes. Warlock master. What's your Any new enemies? Don't tell me he went that way.
Jack Frenzy! Fuck! All right, uh, yeah, that was a turn. Some campaigns are pretty great. No worries, Radiant Ash. No worries. Quite good. <laughs> good plan schemes. Alright, you just stay there. This shit best now mine. I'm transferring years into you. Break, break, kill things. Scurry forward. Alright, yeah, transfer that into here, because I need the replenishment rate into this one here. Just try to heal it as we're making our way up. Bloody Slanesh corruption's gonna be a pain in the ass to get rid of. And walls take eight turns to build. You may touch me only in dreams. You there he is. Have no power over me. Is that a demon? Pull that strikes to land. Oh, you know what's going to happen here? Avalon Impossible. is going to take it off them. <sighs> Well, their turn goes first, so I guess we'll Machines and see. And sorcery. Okay, what else are we doing here? I think that's it for the turn. We got a little bit of money. Let's build a little bit of stuff. Waterloo is probably screwed.
Alright, any new enemies? No. Okay, let's move on. Nothing doing! I wish Grom would focus on somebody else for a change. Oh, we're so close. 25 hour stream incoming. So close. I can smell its crappy sword widow make it garbage. Fuck the sword. Nah, it's it's within my reach. It's within my reach. I just need to go and get it. The no I just have to go and get it. So it ain't even worth it? Oh no, I totally agree. It's not the point. Them coming up my ass, these guys coming through my front. Secret kill. Dawn's hope. Where the hell did that sword of Cain go? Absolutely not. Ready to kill kill. Walk! Warlock engineer! Never. Great many things to see to, so be quick. Dinka, Dinka, Kill, slave. Miscalculated. that all right safe over here yep safe over here yeah kind of just keep an eye on this should be able to sell it and defeat this it didn't seem like it was too strong oh, you're kidding me man you're freaking kidding me as well. Sorcerer Inventor! Yes, yes! Address me as Sia Lord. 
1.21 gigawops! <laughs> yeah, happy new year, everyone. Oy. Shit, it's the 2nd of uh, January for me now. <laughs> this dude's the quietest streamer ever. <laughs> Are you kidding? <laughs> I'm exhausted. I've been streaming for 25 hours. I'm not quiet. I'm just, I'm just exhausted. I wish you guys just voted for me blowing up Scape and Blight, that would have been so much easier. <laughs> Good, that damage is not bad at all. Good. It's not that powerful. So yeah, we're, we're um we're getting ready to build a uh, a vermin tide there. Let's see how that goes. Done sending shit my way. So I said, throw one of these fucking dudes. God, I got no money. 
I can't deal with this shit. need to actually um, jump over there to deal with that and over here we need to make sure this doesn't go anywhere so I need to recruit a quick emergency army sort this out and then um, disband it that should sort it out over here I don't have to do it any anymore and I'm just gonna be too broke shit panic flee oh, I didn't invest that much into it um, and we're a bit busy with some other stuff Did you get the sword of cane? No, not yet. We're, we're very close. It's like right over here somewhere. Problem is, Bellacor is here. Just, there's just a lot of force in this area. That's the biggest problem. I just don't know if I can get it. It's just, it's too fucking entrenched in Ulthwan. Doing what I can. It's so friggin' entrenched. I'm letting the rest of the campaign fall to bits to try to get this fucking sword. It's such a waste of time. You know, building a thematic army is one thing, but like, throwing so much effort into a, such a shit territory for such a shit weapon. Oh my god, this is a punishment. <laughs> it's fucking awful. Like, good, good. yeah, he just refuses to, to actually come at me with the sword of Cain. I just can't get it. Can't face them. Please tell me Bellacor just goes home. Like, why are you here of all places? Go, go away. Ah, oh, thank fuck. 
Chromatic armor is pretty good, but whatever. Get out of my way! At least this guy is going down easily. Dealing with the yeah, the nuisances of this area. If we're lucky, this one will come over here, attack him, and soften him up a little bit for us. Oh my god, look what I got coming up my ass. It's never gonna get built. Doesn't matter. Bellica, 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 I don't have any beef with you. Where is the sword of Cain? <laughs> person who ever deserved this weapon Turn them to rat we're here he's got it and it's Vectic the unstoppable that will claim it for the horned rat finally yes <laughs> finally found it oh my god We'll take it off the cold, dead hands of a demon prince. Oh my god. I'm such a sore throat. <laughs> Where's the exit? There's no exit. They have no choice. They have to fight. I don't like this terrain very much. 
many yucky trees things. In here, actually. Nope, it's not my terrain. Oh, there's a storm vermin in my army. <laughs> Vectik has come to claim your soul, demon. Play claw catapult. Can I see it? Protected by beasts. Where the things? Can I see it? Oh shit then, that's some goddamn wood save. Oh god, that is some serious wood save right there. That is some fucking wood save. Holy shit! God damn, that is some wood save. I've only lost them, but this dude here, holy crap balls. Yeah, it's just a shitload of, of miss of like just stacking resistances. He actually wiped out that rattling gun. That's the rattling. Yeah, well, he freaking nearly instant killed it. Pretty funny if it doesn't actually give it to me. That also that character is actually dead. He was an immortal. 
<laughs> storm vermin got the final blow. <laughs> and then the storm vermin killed him. More, yeah. Yeah, go up that wherever. It's done. It's done. We have it. Sword of Cain. It's done. A crude attempt to subjugate. We're done. Okay. Twenty-five hours. It took an extra hour to do so to do that. Holy Roman Empire did a ten euro uh, super sticker. Appreciate the support today, guys. Massive effort from you guys with the donations. I am completely 100% spent. Um, fun campaign. You know, we got short campaign victory. Ages away from long campaign victory. And now some people are like, do full map. <laughs> not 24 hours. Uh, I need to get, get some rest. Okay. Uh, is there any tidying like of stuff up? Let me just... Update as the um, fundraisers changed much in terms of price. Yeah, a couple of dollars here and there. Man, the um, the Fawcett Society was a dark horse. Really pushed ahead there at the uh, at the end. All right, I need I need to go get some rest. My brain is complete mush. I've been playing Total Warhammer for 25 hours straight bar like one or two bathroom breaks uh, I need to go get some rest we managed to achieve everything we, we got our storm vermin army it's here the other storm vermin is is here we have our doggo army and we got the sword of Cain and we got short campaign victory and are we strength ranking one we have been strength ranking one. I'm just not there at the moment. Alright, well, um, let's go chuck a host over to somebody. I haven't hosted anyone in a while. Let's go see who's streaming Total Warhammer 3. And I will see you guys another time. So let's have a look. Uh, it's not much. Okay, it seems to me that none of these are actually in English. <laughs> uh, is, is anybody streaming at the moment? Do you guys know of anyone that's streaming at the moment you want me to host? Yeah, Happy New Year everyone. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, it's, if someone wants to start up their stream right now, I'll give you like... Like, Radiant Ash, do you want to stream? I'll, I'll chuck a host over to you. If you, if you can get set up in like two minutes. <laughs> well, how about how about this? How about how about people can make up their own minds? Uh, unfortunately, there was just nobody in English that I could um, that I could host that I could see. Um, just send us one of the non-English if it shits and giggles. Mm. No, that actually hurts their channels because if you send a whole, if you send like a thousand people to a channel and that you stick around for like five seconds, um, it lowers their average watch time considerably. It actually hurts them like significantly if you do that. Um, it's not helpful, so I, I don't want to do that to people. Yeah, YouTube can be quite fickle with that kind of stuff. It's not going to help them at all. Both the streamers here are sick. Fair enough. All right. Well, we'll just we'll just call it a day there. People are already dropping off. All right. That's the end of this one, guys. Appreciate you guys. Hope you had a 
Happy New Year. I will see you guys on a stream in the future at some point. Um, don't forget to check out our Valheim channel. Uh, that's probably where I'm going to be most active, apart from, you know, making videos. Um, I think I can get a video out tomorrow. Uh, we'll see how we go. Anyway, it's the end of this one. Appreciate you guys, and we'll see you next time. Fuckers. That's the last time you're going to hear me say that as well. <laughs> Bye.